again. Yo. Can Onik take it AP Brent? If anybody can do it, it's Onik. Yo, yo, yo. Ayan, magandang gabi sa inyo lahat. This is Brady TV sa amin dyan po sa isang live stream. At dahil hindi tayo makapag-livestream sa TikTok, ay dito tayo magla-livestream sa YouTube. AP Brent versus Onik para sa Grand Finals ng Games of the Future. Medyo hinaan ko lang ng konti. Ayan, I hope na okay kayo. Live tayo sa YouTube, guys. Into the grand finals on the lower side, Onyx starts off their run against RCC, and that's where they find their only loss in the bracket. RCC was a team that we have to kind of show some respect to because they had a long run, and no one expected them to be able to get a win off Onyx. But go, live dice on YouTube, guys. In the same fashion that AP Brand won, let's go, let's go. Then move it to face against Fire Flux, and they decimate them. And this is the team that we just saw give the works to RCC. RRQ. It's kind of a tough call to say who had some of the tougher matchups. Okay, na ba? Naka live na ba tayo sa YouTube? Wait lang ah. Who's really their slot here? Homeboys was a team a lot of us. Check natin kung naka live sa tayo sa YouTube. Make quick work of them. Then yun parang hindi ba? At ayun yun start na live natin sa YouTube guys. Hello po. I mean, this is a. Just start lang ng live stream natin. They're just a team that it feels like they haven't even broken a sweat yet, G. Yeah, and again, try not to share muna yung live stream. Let's go. Dito tayo manood. They just have that tenacity and that grit and what it and what it takes to face a team like AP Brim. Now, I would say like the biggest thing is that the meta has kind of shifted a bit, so there is quite the possibility that we see again either team. I would say it's going to be like a 50-50. We went all full full seven matches back at M5. And I can only imagine that they want to go this far again. Just, I mean, just for the sake that yeah. it's, it's going to be great. <laughs> First boss, hello Mark, Larry, and, uh, Chua, hello po. I don't know. I mean, Ayan, you, live tayo sa YouTube, guys. Hindi tayo makapag-live sa TikTok na yun eh. So, sa YouTube tayo, antayin natin. Panoorin natin. Itong mga to, okay? Alam nyo na yan, alam nyo na yan. Ganda na, in fairness, maganda yung naging laro kanina, no? Ng Black, ah, na Black, this tuloy. Maganda yung naging laro kanina ng Fire Flux at ng... RRQ kaya lang di ko alam ano nangyari sa pinakahuling laban na yun struggling din yung team parang hindi sila nakamove on doon sa funny game na irad nung game 1 so nag-expect nag-expect ako ng ano ng something para doon sa game number 3 pero GG's pa rin lakas ng fire flux grabe I mean AP Bren, I would have to say, the numbers-wise, AP Bren is slightly the favorite. I don't think it's anything huge. Sama niyo ako dito, guys, sa YouTube. Dita, dita yung mga paglive sa TikTok. Ah. Mainly just because they are currently the world champions. Not to mention as well, this is the same exact team we're looking at. Ay parang ano? Parang may delay. Parang may delay yung live stream natin. O nga. May delay nga yung live stream Pero wala, tiis lang kayo guys Hindi nyo mahanap yung Hindi nyo mahanap yung live stream Ng Games of the Future Sige, dito na lang kayo makinood sa akin Medyo lakasan natin ng konti Para hindi naman super sa pag-usapag is the full synergy there? Is the team without CW, without the five man that was playing together for a very long time? Ah, lalo magsisimula na. De pero any moment magsisimula na to. There's always, I mean, I think. Oh, yung ganda ng ano? Ganda ng nectar ni GDI ko. Pero kung ano maghanap ng ganyang kulay? Kasi may parehas kami ng kulay na suit ganyan din. Ayos. Check na ito. One of the ways that Onik was really able to turn the tables. Nakakainis na. Ano? Nagka-problema yung TikTok ko. So dito tayo sa YouTube. Magkulitan. Dito tayo sa YouTube. Mag... Samahan nyo ako manood ng laro na to. Kasi magiging maganda at magiging mainit. 
Sa mga hindi makahanap ng live stream, sige, nandito ako. At nandito ang ilan sa mga nag-re-stream din para samahan at tulungan kayo na makapanood <laughs> ng Games of the Future. Ganda to, ganda to laban na to. Ito na. Ito na ata. Oh yeah, wait lang. Hindi pa tayo. RQ taking that, moving on to AP Brin into the semifinals. Again, this is where we were speaking, right? RQ was able to take one on the AP Brin, but they were still able to move on. And then the same thing for Pwede Onyx, right? Pwede ba yung kas mo Tagalog, boss? <laughs> sabi ni, ano, one of the ni Shik. Ah, next time, next time. Ayoko, ayoko, ayoko lang magkas ng Tagalog. Kaya naman. <laughs> Kakalay mo lang, boss. Pero ito yung kakalive ko lang. Sobrang linaw, men, no? Hindi ko alam kung ako lang nakakapansin, pero sobrang linaw ng livestream, ha? It's just been a great time, to be honest, for all these teams. Kakalive ko lang randomly, man. It's a great learning experience for them. Siguro sa mga susunod na araw dito na rin tayo maglalive stream. Tsaka abangan nyo rin ang MPL ha. Magsisimula na rin ang uh, MPL Philippines. So, dapat excited kayong lahat. <laughs> Kasi kami excited na kami. Doon pa rin naman sa ano, doon pa rin naman sa shooting gallery studio gagawin. Yung MPL Philippines. Napupunda ba kayo dito sa Riyadh, sa MSC? Yan ang sikreto ba? <laughs> Pero if ever man, kunyari pala rin, kunyari pala rin, na pumunta kami lahat dyan, sasalubungin nyo ba kami dyan sa Riyadh? <laughs> yan, ang, yan ang malaking tanong dyan. Ano, chic. But kind of, uh, they, Sasalubungin nyo ba kami Diyan sa Riyadh If ever man If ever ah Wala pa kang sinasabi Right right I will say one thing that's kind of sticking out to me is that they either like they don't know. We can go a little bit more depth. Okay. Later, but they do not like Jordan. Okay. 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 Okay
And he was kind of the game changer. Ngayon grand final so sayang hindi kayo makakapanood. Sayang, sayang naman. Tagal naman ang daming ko. Daming kwento ng caster. <laughs> Alam ba yan yung mga common na ano sa amin? Common na Common na ano sa amin? Ang tagal naman. Tagal naman puro puro sarili tayong caster ganun. <laughs> <laughs> Pero di ba kung isipin mo, lalo mga kaming control doon. And yan yung tinatawag na stretch. Kailangan nila mag-stretch dahil may mga nangyayari pa sa game, di ba? Maraming libreng food. Talaga? Legit? Yeah, wala eh. Ano? Yaman kasi ng ano, mayaman ng Saudi. Yung Riyadh eh. First world country eh. Ayan ang uh, first world country problem. Kami dito sa Pilipinas, alam mo na... Nasa third world country tayo, kailangan na. <laughs> Ang problema natin dito, una, traffic. And then May or June kung nagsis, ano? Doon, nagsisimula tag-init sa Saudi. Talaga? Ay, Noel ba? Galing, galing ka ba Noel sa Saudi? Gusto ko lang malaman. Sabi ni Fernando niya, Ignacio Jr. Ilang hours po ba break between games? Hindi, any moment magsisimula na to. Any moment magsisimula na to. <laughs> Parang nag, ano lang ata, prepare lang yan. Rap, rap, or rex. Pahinga nga natin, kumakanta sila eh. If we, if we want to go a bit more, one thing we will say from both teams is, surprisingly on Kyrie, we have Sobrang init po ng month of June. Talaga? He's really kind of shifted over to the Philippines. Feeling ko doon tatapat yung MSC eh. Feeling ko lang ha. If he can get his hands on the Guinevere, it's still a pretty mechanical hero. We do see some great things from it. He was able to play... Pero based doon sa ano, based sa database na meron ako. Parang... Against Fireflux, we got to see him pick out the Nolan, also extremely Based dito sa database na, wow, parang ang ganda ng... Big focus bands. Ang ganda ng chance ng AP bread dito naman na. The Gwen and the Nolan, I think it's very possible that they don't let that through. Ano ba highest win rate nila na here? You mentioned that they don't like to ban the Joy. They have let it through one time against Homeboys. And they came in with the Hilda. They came in with the Basha, with something very similar to what we saw Fireflex do against RQ Hoshi's Fanny. They came in very aggressive. Sana makalas at Guinevere, no? Iba rin yung impact ng Guinevere. Iba rin yung impact ng Guinevere. Yep, two and a half years ako si Saudi Jeddah ako galing. Ah, no, nice. Iba naman pala si Guya Noel. Anong work mo doon, Noel? By the way, si Noel, isa po sa mga supporters natin yan sa TikTok. Kaya lang, hindi tayo makapag-live sa TikTok ngayon eh. Pin pinalo tayo na TikTok eh. <laughs> pinalo ako na TikTok, boss eh. Doon ko naranasan habulin ng mga alim... Ano? Doon ko naranasan habulin ng mga alimasag at manguha ng lobster sa dati. Talaga? Ang as naman nun. <laughs> Mainit pero di pinagpapawisan. Pa bakit? Bakit ganun? Malamig yung klima dyan. Diba? Ma malamig yung yung buong area ma pero ma mainit yung sikat ng araw parang ganun hindi ka pinagpapawisan kasi malamig yung ano yung lapag parang ganun Looks like their match is around like 15 minutes out, so we definitely still have quite a bit of time. Yeah, nyo malalaman din natin yun. Sana naman, sana. Magdilang ano? Magdilang ang hel tayo. What What are they thinking? You know, like what is your strategic approach? May init, maganda ng ano? Maganda ng laban nato eh. Gold laner. And isa sa mga siguro ano ano? Nakita natin na nagstand out para sa Onyx Esports ay itong si Albert kasi di ba hindi nakapaglaro si CW ang balita ako kasi kaya hindi nakapaglaro si CW kasi may sakit may sakit daw si CW so yun yung yun yung kwento pero ang ganda na yung laro ni Albert ha makailang beses din siyang nag ano eh MVP Nakilang MVP. Ay, sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Nakilang MVP ba dun siya, no? Based sa aking database. May database kasi ako, eh. Naman, Albert. With the triple T. Diba? Diba? 
three times, three times ng MVP. Di ba ang ganda nang nilalaro actually ni Albert eh. And parang sampal to sa mga haters niya na, di ba sobrang daming haters ni Albert. Uh, sampal sa mga haters, para sa mga haters ko. Eh, siguro yung sinasabi ni Albert. Para sa mga haters ko na Indo. Sa inyo to, para sa inyo to. John Jandayo, hello, hello, gusta? 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 <laughs> Mainit boss, di makahawak ng manibela ng sasakyan pag tag-init. Di ko alam kung paano ipapaliwanag yung init. Pero init na nakakabanat ng balat na. Talaga? <laughs> pero hindi ka pinagpapawisan. Ganun ba yan? <laughs> Medyo weird eh, no? Sabi ni Noel Malyari, heavy equipment operator ako. Drilling, hawak ko, tinitibag namin mga bundok. Ah! Oh. Boy, bigat pala work mo dyan, ano, Noel. Tapos pag uwi mo dito, nag-business ka na lang, no? At least ngayon, ano ka, mas... Mas, ano ka, mas... Alam mo, mas komportable ka dito sa... Sa Pilipinas, di ba? Kasama mo family mo. Eh, kayo ba, Shik? Ano ba? Uh, kasama mo na ba dyan family mo? Nadala mo na ba dyan family mo? Or meron ka bang mga friends na kasama din dyan sa Saudi? Ah, sa ano? Tama sa Saudi. Like, she is a monster. So, probably going into this game... I mean, we might be seeing like a minnow, we might be seeing <laughs> Guinevere. These are just heroes that are just excelling in this current meta. Though, like we were building upon, like the Clint stole is a good thing in the hands of AP Bren. The, the Axborg that we're not seeing too much of, but they are pulling out, is something that works for them. It works for their comp, their aggressive turret takes. Um, AP Bren just has that capability. Now, Tagal naman, man. Ba't ang tagal? Akala ko magsisimula na kasi di ba bumalik na? Medyo mahirap na para sa mga casters na kasi parang medyo mahaba yung stretch na binigay sa kanila. Tignan mo, hindi na sila, wala na silang icon sa mga cameras nila. Ganda lang suit ni Trek. Ay, ni GD Ico. Meron ako niyan. Yan yung sinuot ko. Ganyan yung sinuot ko nung ano, nung media day. Dito na, yung buhok ko na naman. Yeah. Yeah. Nasa TikTok mo din ako madalas, ano, taga-send ng treasure box, boss. Ah! Uy! Maraming salamat, ah, sa pag-support dun sa TikTok. Wala yung naka, ano kasi, may, may, naging problema kasi sa TikTok, eh. So, bukas ko pa magagamit yung TikTok ko. Pang livestream. <laughs> Pasaway kasi yung tito mo, eh. Pasaway si Burrito, eh. So, yun. Bukas ko pa magagamit, eh. Kaya di ako makapag-livestream. Stream ngayon sa TikTok. Dapat sa TikTok te, tsaka sa YouTube. So, ngayon dito muna. Kalma dogs muna tayo. <laughs> Sakto ng 11 natin yung championship game, sabi ni Random Limat. Oh, ilang 10 minutes na lang pala, pre. 10 minutes na lang. Kalmahan lang natin ang ating mga pototoy. Kalmahan lang natin ang mga pototoy natin, okay? Kalma dogs lang tayo. Pag-usapan lang natin ang mga kailangan pag-usapan. We have Philippine Season 13, magsisimula na, March 15. And, first time natin makikita si Hans na wala sa desk. Kasi ngayon ay full-time host na siya kasama ni Mara. For sure naman na-announce na rin siya. So, nakita na rin siya dun sa mga posters. Sa posters na pinost ng MPL Philippines. So, first time itong mangyayari. At ang newest edition para sa family ng MPLPH Talents ay si Brigida. Congratulations kay Brigida.
Every every time I show up, every time I show up, somehow somehow Malaysia loses. Uh, so I don't know. Um, well, Malaysia's not here, so we're safe. <laughs> Nah, man. <laughs> I'm, I'm staying out of this one. I'm staying out of this one. No, like I said, AP Bren is definitely the favorite. AP Bren is definitely the favorite. Yeah. Um, I, I think I think they are the favorite here. Um, like I said, I've already kind of explained. Mikey, it. Mikey, Mikey cheese mismo na tayo sa kanila dito. Philippines still holds on to be the strongest region. Ang haba ng ano nila, bre. Ang haba ng stretch nila. Kung 11 nga ang start, meron pa tayong 9 minutes. Kumuha na kayo ng kape, kumuha na kayo ng mga chichirya. Kasi best of 5 to, medyo mahaba-haba ang... Uh, Ating dadaanan, Axman, shoutouts to you, bro. Magandang ng gabi. Sa mga nagahanap ng Tagalog broadcast, pwede po kayong mag-check doon sa Facebook page, ah, Facebook, YouTube channel ng Games of the Future MLBB. Kung gusto nyo ng, ng Tagalog broadcast, na English broadcast, o oh, sige, dito tayo. Gusto nyo, kasko pa to eh. Gusto nyo ba, kasko, nyo nga, kasko na nga ba to? <laughs> ano, pwede ko to ikas. Kung, kung trip nyo ikas to, ikakas ko to. Oh, habang wala pa, mag-jamming-jamming muna tayo, pre. six months or so i mean even before that a lot of people i mean they were the favorites um in the season before last msc before echo and black ayan habang wala pa guys eh jamming muna tayo di ba kikwentuhan pa sila eh sana nag-abuti ng game 5 actually yan yan din ang aking hinihiling Dinig ba yung gitara? Parang hindi. <laughs> Throw daw laro ano RQ kanina, ano, kanina ng game versus FFE. ID sinisisi ulit mga players natin. <laughs> Walang throw dun, pre. Hindi ka pwede mag-throw dun. Bakit? Una, kapag natalo kayo dun, mas mababa yung price, uh, price money na makukuha nyo. Okay? Mas mababa yung makukuha yung pera. So, bakit mo ito throw? Diba? Gets nyo ba? Hindi ko alam kung bakit may mga nagsasabi ng ganun. <laughs> Siyempre, gusto mong manalo dun. Ano ba yun? Wala namang ganun, boss. Sino ba namang ayaw, mata ayaw manalo? Sino ba namang ayaw kumita ng pera? Siyempre, lahat naman sila gustong kumita ng pera. Kung iisipin mo nga, yun na yung, yun na yung pinakamataas na pwedeng makuha ng RRQ. Doon sa... Diba? Kung yung dating lineup nila, baka hindi pa sila umabot eh. Baka hindi pa sila umabot sa top 4 eh. Diba? With the addition of Erad, tsaka ni Brusco. Diba? Isipin nyo yun, pre. Sabi ni Gary Official, 3-1 yan, AP Bren, sure win. Gusto ko kasi 3-2, pre. Pero siyempre gusto ko AP Bren pa rin naman na Para masakit, alam nyo, para masakit-sakit sa mga ID fans. <laughs> Sabi ni Carlo, I'm from the I'm from the Philippines and I have a question from you uh from from you. Why does Indonesia call the Eden Leaf Village or Konoha of Southeast Asia? <laughs> Di ko alam. Siguro dahil isa tayo sa mga nagpo-produce sa tayo sa mga building blocks <laughs> ng mga <laughs> sa, isa tayo sa mga nagpo-produce ng mga magagaling na MLBB players ewan ko eh, ewan ko pre, ewan ko kasi eto di ko alam kung magigets nyo to ha sa mga nanonood ng Naruto kaya, kaya nila sinasatawag na Uchi ha kasi di ba parang ano yung mga quote and quote nagtrydor ganon ewan ko <laughs> Sabi ni Catherine Tukero, balitan mo na kasi doon di namin maintindihan. Ay, eh, amo lang sila. Gusto niyo ba ako na mag-cast? Ikaw magiging aking 
pala Kung ikay magiging aking Aking Ikaw nga muli Duha pa Ang aking Pangakong Pangakong di ka lolokohin Shout out to Idol, shout out to Idol, shout out to Axman Sabi ni Jason, shout out, shout out sa'yo Jason Ikas mo ba boss? O sige, ikas natin mamaya Mamaya pagka napainit, nagpainit tayo Boss, kailan at saan ang venue ng MPLPH S13? Carlo, sa... Shooting gallery pa rin ang ating venue at mag-start siya sa March 15. Okay. Paul Diala, idol ba rito na may miss ko na boses mo sa pagkakaster? Abangan nyo, abangan nyo, abangan nyo. Wala pa akong schedule pero official na ako magkaka sa MPLPH. Another season. Marami marami salamat. Ano yan, bossing isang magbalik nga dyan. Ano ba yan? Medyo hina lang natin Ayan, nak magsisimula na Hindi lang kasanan natin, konti Boss, hindi na tayo makakantay And it looks like we're diving into something here. AP Prince, most picks and most bands. Eh, may julas na natin ng konte. Most bands are probably what we want to take a look at, right? Gwen, Joy. Mark Jerome, Mark. Oh, hello, Arat. Kung sa watch party dito, Discord dito siya. Sige, wait lang, papasok ako jan, papasok ako jan. Shout out idol, low axman, axman. Um. Sabi ni Sheik, ang Indonesia kinukuha na sa atin lahat. Una, yun sa... Uy, wag yan, wag yan, wag yan. Political shit yan, wag yan. Sabi ni Anthony Flores, AP Brand for sure win. Sa M5 nga, di umubra, GF pa kaya. Shoutout, sir. Shoutout si Anthony Flores. Shoutout. Paul De Alla, shoutout sa'yo. Shoutout daw sa pinakamamahal kong idol na si Myra Zyra. Shoutout sa'yo, Myra Zyra. I hope na okay ka palagi. Mag-iingat ka. Mag-sanitize palagi gamit ang alcohol. At huwag magpupuyat. Yun na yun. O, lakihan na natin pre ha. Game na. Game na. Ito na, magsisimula na boy. Medyo magsisimula na, tara na. Broadcast mo nga boss para maganda manood umay sa English. Ito na nga mga kaibigan. Dali, doon ka nga. Apat na. Iyan na ka. Kakas ko na na. At nakikita na ka natin dito. Mataas ang prayo sa Lapu tsaka sa Ruby. Yung Ruby mataas ang prayo pero hindi ganun kataas ang win rate. Wait lang, papasok na ako. Let's jump into a little video so we can actually rest our voice for the grand finals. We'll see you guys here soon. Ayun, may video pa. May commercial pre. Kinemercial pa tayo, boy. Shout out Jordan Cortez. Hello. Kamusta? Kamusta? Sabi ni Sheik, ano, boss Burito, may nakapagsabi naman sa'yo, nakaboses mo si Rob Luna. Nakakabis si Rob Luna. Marami, sobrang dami na nagsabi sa akin. Pero ito nakakatawa, about kay Rob, about kay Rob. Ito nakakatawa, hindi ko pa napapanood si Rob dati. Hindi ko siya super napapanood. Pero alam ko yung pangalan niya kasi nag-stream siya. Tapos, nung nag-start ako sa casting, may mga nagsasabi sa akin na parang kaboses ko daw si Rob Luna. Ngayon, chinay ko si Rob. Yung speaking voice kasi namin halos parehas. Mas ano lang siya. Ako kasi mas kanto yung, ano, yung pagsasalita ko. Yung, yung, 
yung mga term na ginagamit ko pang kanto siya kasi konyo konyo type na ano pag nagsasalita siya yung normal voice niya tapos yun tapos sa casting yun ang pair ko may 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 pagkakaiba yung casting style namin tsaka may pagkakaiba din yung the way namin gamitin yung mga boses namin pero parehas modulated ganun si si ano si Rob Luna yung casting voice niya yun pa rin yun yung, yung speaking voice niya mas maarte lang yun. sa akin naman mas masigaw kasi ako eh so yun. mas garalgal yung boses ko tsaka mas, mas masigaw <laughs> sabi ni Siler Leon Manzano uh, shout out lo ano shout out lo di ka namin nila Tito Boy at Paul shout out sa Siler Leon Manzano magandang gabi magandang gabi po game na ito na magsisimula na ata ay hindi highlights pa Panawin na natin highlights. Huwag ding highlights. Ayan. Panawin na natin highlights. <laughs> Shout out Idol. Sabi ni Wasalak. Wasalak. Shout out. Magandang gabi. Magandang gabi. Jason, hello sa'yo. Hello, Shikik. <laughs> Shikik. <laughs> Oo, totoo. Same talaga kayo. Oh, may, may mga... May, may halos may mga pagkakapareha talaga. Pero alam nyo ba, ang, ang pinagbasihan ko ng casting ko ay ang mga legend Manji na tsaka Shingo sila talaga na, nakikinig na ako ng Dota cast before sila yung sila ano pa sila strike pa pero nakikinig lang ako natatawa lang kasi ako sa mga alam mo yung mga titohan titohan casting nila nila Lo nila Duno yun ang, ang saya nila pakinggan pero kasi nag evolve na yung casting eh and sa, M sa MPL sobrang laki ng in evolve ng casting na nahaluan na siya ng traditional na sports broadcasting at saka yung esports parang pinag pinaghalo siya so mas mas klaro na yung gusto mong ay, mas klaro na yung patutunguhan ng mismong broadcast mas mas organized na mas hati na mas nadedivide na ng maayos yung roles ng bawat casters na nandoon For example, yung pagkakaiba ng anchor, play-by-play -play at analyst. Marami pa rin nalilito ng mga, ka na mga casual viewer dun eh. So, yun. At mamaya, habang wala pa, habang naka-break pa tayo, paliwanag ko. Explain ko mamaya. Axman, shoutout sa'yo. Idol, ikaw na mag-cast. Ang ganda ng boses mo yung mala MPL. <laughs> Wag na! Yan na natin sila. <laughs> yan na natin si, you know, si Trex. Alam mo ba, idol ko yan si Trex? Ang ganda ng boses niyan eh. Ang ganda ng boses ni Trex. Shoutout Arjek, uh, idol pa shoutout watching here from Mindanao with my baby Shane, salamat. Shoutout sa'yo Arjek Kaste at shoutout din sa'yo, sa yung baby na si Shane. Sana ako may baby. Hindi, <laughs> chakla may baby din ako ha. <laughs> Anthony Flower, shoutout sa'yo. Ano, sir, ano price nila dyan? Prediction nyo po. Pa shoutout po ang asawa ko, Mrs. Brea Vena Tiaro. Shoutout sa'yo, Mrs. Mrs. Rhea Vena Tiaro. Yun, ingat ka palagi at uh, yun, mag-iingat ka kay Anthony Flores. Hindi, joke lang. Mabait yan si Anthony Flores. Hindi ko kilala personal yan, pero alam ko mabait yan. <laughs> Tsaka yung price nila dito, wala, maliit lang. 55 million pesos lang ang price pool, pre. 55 million pesos. So, it means na kapag ka nanalo ka dito, basta may sure ball ka na 160,000 US dollars. So, approximately 6.5 M. Okay? Yun yun. <laughs> palo, palo yan pre. Wait lang ah, i-calculate natin. Calculator. Oh, sige. Magkano ba ang ano ngayon? Palitan. Oh, so 55, 55 ang peso to US. Ah, US to peso. US dito peso. 350 times 55. Ito po, oh, ito po ang mapapanalunan ng magcha-champion. Wait lang. Hindi pala. Ito ang mapapanalunan na magcha-champion, ha? Ayan. Ayan ang mapapanalunan na magcha-champion. 19 million, pre. <laughs> tag -iisa, kahit tag-iisang million sila dyan, laki pa na nga O sabihin na natin, sige sa organi organization. Yung 20% ng price pool sa organization. Yung 80% sa kanilang lahat. Pre, ang laki pa rin nun. Ang laki pa rin nun. Diba? <laughs> 
Mm-hmm. Sabi ni Darren, ano, ako si Darren, shoutout po sa asawa ko na malakas po mag-email sa akin. Lagay mo yung pangalan, Darren. Lagay mo yung pangalan. <laughs> Pero may ganyan na, may mga mag-partner na naglalaro sila ng email. Tapos ang nakakatawa doon, mas magaling pa yung babae maglaro ng ML sa kanya. Di ba? <laughs> Uh, shout out sa iyo Ruel Les Baco ah, Les Cabo, hello po Parang duno lang Ano Yayaman tayo, Easy Bugatti <laughs> Easy Bugatti And highlights lang ah. Pre, 19 million ha Tandaan nyo, 19 million <laughs> Kapag ka natalo ka naman May 160 ka Wait lang, 160 USD times 55. Oh. Yan, meron ka namang ganito. 8 million. Pwede na, pre. Matalo ka. Manalo matalo may 8 million kang uuwi. ba? Diba? I hope it's going to be worth your while. This is AP Bren. It's going to be going up against Onik. Now we talk. Hindi ka natalo dun, pre. Ano, ano ka ba? Ah, ito na. Magsisimula na. Magsisimula na. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We got the one, the only Uh, shout out sa'yo, John X. Bungo yan. Pa-shout out, boss. N- ano, ni Bench Cabantanya from Sambuanga del Norte. Shout out sa'yo, Bench Cabantanya. Ingat ka dyan sa Sambuanga. Nung nag- yung nag- nagkaroon ng tournament dyan, di ba? Yung sa Sibugay. Yung sobrang ganda ng event na yan. Yeah, ano, baka next time makasama kami dyan sa ano, pista sa Sibugay. Uh, Antayin natin. <laughs> Ah, who in my opinion has just showed up to such an extent. This is Onik. Here the Gary Fisher boss post time 5k AP Bren. Ko na lang ayo ko. Nagnananahimik ako rito eh. It's always lovely to see like the fans just bring in the bring in the Nap ganang kapustahan diyan sa comment section no. Limbaga June D shout out sa iyo. Magandang gabi. Good evening, good evening. Enjoy natin to. Enjoy natin tong tournament na to. Ano predict mo sino man nanalo? Syempre AP Brand, pero 3-2, 3-2 AP Brand. Julius and Mario, shout out sa iyo. Magandang gabi. Magandang gabi po. Alam ko AP Brand kayo. Chantal Mendoza, boss pa shout out. Shout out sa iyo, Chantal Mendoza. Ingat lagi. Gashiel Blanca, hello po, shout out sa iyo. Tsaka kay Jonex. Hello sa iyo. Jonex Bongo yan. Game na. Game na, let's go, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Sabi ni Julius Almario, bus burito may balak pa ba bumalik si Shinbo magcaster? Pa show, pa shout out. Shout out sa iyo. Julius Almario. Ah, uh, nakakasama ba naman namin magka si Shinbo eh sa iba't ibang mga events, sa real me events, sa mga amateur events. Nakakakast pa namin siya. Pero ngayon hindi ko pa masasabi kasi lagi naman sinasabi ni Shinbo na hindi baka hindi na siya bumalik sa casting pero once in a while ay nagkakast. <laughs> pero sobrang bait ni Shinbo kasi. Tsaka iba na yung ano niya. Iba na yung path niya. Um, nag nagma-manage na rin kasi siya ng uh, production. So, I I Iba na eh, nasa likod na kasi siya ng camera eh. Siya, siya yung nag nag-handle ng mga production, nag, nung naka, parang hawak nila nung nakaraan yung music laban, basta ganun sa pro, more on sa production. Then, ang lawak na rin kasi ng alam ni Shinbu bukod sa pagiging content creator, bukod sa pagiging host. Sobrang daming ganap niyan. Randomly mad, may sakit ba si Sans? Hindi ka alam eh. Kasi kahapon din, di ba, nakaano siya? Yung parang ganon. Di ko alam eh. Tapos naka-jacket. Super lamig kasi dyan, pre. Kaya magigits mo si Sans kung bakit naka... Ano siya? Nakatalokbong siya. Naka-jacket siya na makapal, di ba? So I'm hoping that that's the case, right? Shout out Boss Breach, John Patrick Lagahit. Shout out sa'yo! Ano, John Patrick Lagahit. Tsaka Mark Larry Chua. Hello, hello. Gary Official, sure, sure na yan. Sabik na si Plop Mandurog. <laughs> Pero kahapon, grabe, sobrang lala ni Plop TZ, di ba? Putik. Hindi mo maano eh. Ako yung nangingiwi habang ginaganong-ganon ng X-Borg. Habang sinusunog ng X-Borg. Pre, ako yung nangingiwi po, tsaka. <laughs> I think it's huge. Like I think uh, diba? game one is gonna be. Diba? Shout out Josh Play Silo sa yo. Boss BJ shout out sa yo. Tsaka kay Darren. Lodi ko pa naman noon. 
pa manjin bu tandem. Maski ako, actually kapag napapanood ko nga yung manjin bu na magkasama, natutulala pa rin ako eh. Nagiging fan pa rin ako. At saka hindi nakakasawa maging fan ng mga casters na yun. Kasi lagi kang may matututunan kapag ka nanonood ka sa kanila, kapag ka nakikinig ka sa kanila. Yun. Lagi kang may mapupulot. Alvin, shoutout sa'yo. Alvin Paglumotan. Hello sa'yo. At saka e-robbery mo to. Shoutout sa'yo. Idol from Dabao. Hello. Hello sa mga taga Davao, kumusta kayo? Sana maimbitahan kami sa il ilan sa mga esports events dyan or kahit hosting events, kita-kits tayo dyan. Abangan nyo, baka, real me, baka may ano tayo, may lipad tayo dyan. <laughs> John Michael Ribusa III, shoutout sa'yo from Cebu. Hello, hello po. Uh, mananalo ka ba boss kay Tito Mikey sa basketball? Sabi ni John John Blanc, Blanc Caber. Ay hindi, pro yun eh. Ah, eh Ex-pro yun eh. Nag, naglaro na sa mga amateur leagues yun eh. Naglaro na sa UAAP and CAA yun eh. So, UAAP? Uh, UP kasi yun eh. UAAP. Uh, UP yun. Hindi, hindi natin kaya yun. Pre. Kahit pa huminto na siya sa pagbabasketball, lugi pa rin tayo doon. Huminto siya sa basketball, huminto rin naman ako sa basketball. Eh. What's a luck? Shoutout sa'yo. Idol ang Pogi mo parang ako. Siyempre naman. Tanda mo, Pogi tayo. In our own way. <laughs> yun na yun. Shoutout sa mga taga Cebu, John Michael Ribusa. Shazam! Shoutout sa'yo. Nagarguting, shoutout. Shoutout from Pangasinan. Hello sa'yo, Snowy. Kamusta? Tsaka LBJ. <laughs> si LBJ nandito, bro. Oh. <laughs> Yan ang Golden State yung suot ko, bro. Who knows? I mean, they might flip the script and friggin steamroll AP again. Sabi ni Makovex Pascual. Boss Aaron, pa-shout out. Uy, alam mo pangalan ko. Ba't alam mo yung pangalan ko, pre? Alam mo yung first name ko. Boss Aaron, pa-shout out sa kapatid ko, si Bobby Jones. Hello sa kapatid mo na si Bobby Jones. Kumain ka na sana ng gabihan mo or ng hapunan mo kasi ako hindi pa. Goal ni Super Marga magpasikat pa sabi niya sa interview O naman O naman Tsaka ngayon sikat na siya Sobrang sikat na niyan Sabi ni Kian Fana ang pa-shoutout boss from Baguio Ayan, shoutout sa'yo Tsaka sa mga taga Baguio Hello po sa inyo Galing nga kami nung nakaraang linggo dyan Nasa lunas punta kami bataan May tamang gala lang kami Hehehe Pakamusta kay Ate Mo Chantel, sabi ni Darren. O naman, o naman. Lagi naman. Alam mo, dami nagtatanong sa akin dati niyan kung, kung ano, kung jowa ako daw ba si Chantel. <laughs> sa mga di, sa mga di nakakala, may, may partner na pa ako sa buhay. Okay. Pasyara po from Ilocos Norte. Hello, Shazam. Prediction mo, Lods, Onyx versus Bren. Siyempre, Bren tayo, pero 3-2. 3-2 John Michael Simulan na yan Let's go, let's go Kevin Kelvin, hello Farley Shoutout sa'yo from El Nido, Palawan Hello, Mac of X Pascual Ex-office mate po Ay legit, legit ba? Ex-office mate kita sa sa kanyan Sa home credit Yeah, and it Okay, the phobia is being interesting One thing that we just want to keep an eye out for, right, is that if A.K. Brin doesn't ban the Guinevere, Okay lang, lakasan natin ng konti. Lakasan natin ng konti. Then A.P. Brin is trying to build the Guinevere into this current setup. So I feel like that's the biggest thing to keep an eye out for. Shout out from Saudi Arabia. Hello, Kelvin, Carlo, Reselis. Sa mga taga-Saudi, hello po. Kanina may taga-Riyad dyan. The comment section. I love that from a team. I feel like that that is what we should see, and they definitely take their time. Nathaniel, hello. Was Aaron pa shout out sa GF ko na si Ming Ming from Dubai. Hello, hello po. Sa mga taga Dubai. Nata ng konte. Yan. Sabi ni Kelvin, shoutout daw sa asawa niya Ikaw naman natutulog na yung asawa mo Pinapashoutout mo pa Alexis, hello Alexis Philippines lang sa kalam Shoutout from Antique Hello sa mga taga Antique Shoutout from Pampanga, Mark Gordon Hello po, shoutout sa family mo Shoutout din bro Shoutout boss Aaron ang baby na si Yurin. Ay, may baby ka na rin. Hello, hello sa baby mo na si Yurin. Chance ng brand na manalo, Lods. Mataas ba? Makikita natin yan mamaya, Andrean. 
sa first game. Okay. So, maaring may Nolan. Yun na nga, nakuha na yung Nolan. Predict natin, pre. Predict natin yung mga player, uh, heroes na lalabas. Hmm. Aha. Pwede sila mag-vex sana based dun sa trajectory ng heroes na kinukuha nila. Uh, vex sana para sa Onyx. Arlot, available. Again, first pick into a Nolan. I, I feel like they should go some type of a... I was about to say like a utility, a tanky... <laughs> Wait lang natawa ko. <laughs> Sabi ni Trip Mo TV, pa shout out lang, it's nonchalant ng antique. Hello sa'yo, Trip Mo TV. Ay, na Arlot. Ay, kumuha na sila ng Arlot, tas Novaria. Okay. So, gets, magigets mo rin ko bakit kumuha sila ng Novaria dito. Kasi, uh, ano eh, me, Nolan medyo sneaky yan eh. Lagi nasa damo yan eh. Ang AP brand, pwede na sila mag-Mino. Tsaka, Nana. Mino Nana. Feeling ko ah, Mino Nana. Or Mino... Tsaka Brody Mino Nana Mino Brody Uy hari pre Okay okay So medyo mahirap tap, Mahirap ang tapatan Pwedeng Nathan Para sa uh, Onyx Pag hindi pa nila kinuha yung Nathan Pwedeng iban to ng AP Bren Oh Onik gonna lock in the Fredrin here, so it looks like they are gonna go the utility route. Something to deal with the Nolan. The Phobius. Shout out to Asawa ko na si Rona Sadang. Sabi ni Renslayer Channel. Shout out po. Shout out kay Rona Sadang. Shout out mo na tayo. Habang wala pa. Hello po sa ano? Kay Rainsy ng Risk Prodigies. Sabi ni Rainsy. Hello, hello po. Shout out kas mga. Ayoko. Ayan natin sila. Nakikinig nga ako eh. Narinig nyo naman ng maayos. Hindi hindi naman super... Hindi, mas malakas kasi dapat yung boses ko. Sorry. Commentary ko kasi to eh. Naka... Ito kasing live stream na to. Restream to. Pero commentary ko pa rin. Ayan. So, hindi pwede kasing tumatakbo lang to na naka-live. Kasi hindi siya part ng... Fair use ng YouTube. So, yun. Na nakawa ng hero si Albert. O nga eh. Pero ang lakas ni Albert, pre ah. Promise ah. Ang lakas ni Albert. Ako nabili ba kay Albert? And yun yung maganda sa mga pro players talaga, no? Parang ready sila mag-step up every time na may mangyayari. Kasi, ang balita ay nagkasakit si... Ah, uh, dito? Nagkasakit itong si CW tapos... And, Napilitan, I mean, nagla-force itong si Albert. Siyempre, anim lang naman sila eh, di ba? Shout out daw kay Playboy, Car Playboy Carty, sabi ni Vinmar Vargas. Hello po, Vinmar. Shout out from Palawan, Jassy Marasan. Ma Maraasin, hello po. Hmm. Okay, tanggal ng Tams. No thamus, they pick up the Arlon. Ano ba 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 din dito? Lapu Lapu is Clint. still open. Ayun, Clint. Uh, Ito, Clint. Tanggal na, Clint. I think Lapu could simply know that AP Bren is kind of... Shout out po, boss burrito kay Dennis Estacio. Sabi ni Shane Giro Mad Madronero. Shout out sa'yo, Dennis Estacio. Magpuyat ka na, tara na. AP Bren na, pre. What's up, Juan? Hello sa'yo, Juan. Nocturn. Nocturne ba yan? Nocturne. <laughs> Shoutout sa wife ko na si Wala. Hello sa iyo, Wala. Wala! Shoutout sa pabaya akong nagpa-plant siya, sabi ni Darwin. Sino yun? <laughs> may Tagalog broadcast po to actually. Ah. May, mayroon pong Tagalog broadcast daw. So kung gusto nyo pong manood ng Tagalog broadcast, Tagalog na shoutcast, eh, punta po kayo sa mismong uh, YouTube channel ng ano ng Games of the Future. Ako ako'y nag nag ano lang naman dito. <laughs> Punta kayo dun sa YouTube channel ng Games of the Future, pwede po. Tapos sanapin niyo lang yung Tagalog broadcast. Parang Uy, glue. Glue pick, glue, glue. 
It is, it is, so oh. here's, a, here's a pocket pick. Wow. Something that they think can deal with mm. the, uh, the CC here. Wow. Interesting. Another, but it's another one that can also kind of... May DPS to... naman na sila na kahit pa paano eh. Ito set up, no? Wow. Uh, wow. Kakaiba to. Claude. Sad, Gusto ko yung Claude pambasag sa... Pang ano? Pang backlash dun sa glue. Let's. Let's. Of AP Brand. It's only game one. Ganda to, ganda, ganda. Lakasan natin na. Nothing less of these two teams who are never scared. Let's go. Something a little bit outside of the meta. Go GSW. This is, awesome, right? this is what I was saying. Like, go GSW. Teams probably had that like <laughs> the rabbit in the hat, and maybe it's glue. Game, game, maybe game. Maybe it's like no one's ever tried him. Maybe he's gonna absolutely dominate in the land of dawn, and if anybody can do it, it's gonna be AP Brand, right? Ganda to, pre. Maganda to. Ayan, kapit na kayo, ha. Kapit kayo sa inyo mga inuubuan kasi papasok na tayo sa portal. Alright. Games of Future Grand Finals for Mobile Legends is about to begin. We're about to hop through the portal into the land of dawn to start off the rematch. The revenge match. Iintrohan na natin. At ito na, papasok na para sa Grand Finals. Onyx Esports. Game na, game na. Manood na tayo, boss. Okay. Shoutout. Mamaya na ako mag-shoutout, ha? Nood na tayo. Top ang Nicky Boy, oh. Puray ko, boss. Dinilay, pre. Dinilay. Then poking and probing at this point. One thing also at the very end, AP. Kulang ng isang minion siya na, super Marco. Ganda ng ginawa nila. Factor into you know the solid CC that they need it. It does seem like AP Brand wants to control. Wala naman tagal. Meron, may tagalog broadcast to, may tagalog broadcast ang mga casters. Ang mga casters, sila Joshi Kick, sila Quirty, si Brigida, sila Athena, sila yung casters, sila Ingan. Meron Tagalog, pre, meron. Sila yung mga casters, eh. They're quick people. You got the Nolan. Pero komportable naman kayo. English kasi ito, eh. Na broad kasi, eh. I think it's definitely gonna be a battle. Pakilitan ka mo. Okay na yan, pre. Sobrang laki ba ng cam ko? Sige, lilitan ko nga. Sobrang, sobrang, sobrang laki ba niya tingnan, pre. Sorry, ah. Ayan, lilitan ko konti. Okay na ba yan? Ayan, okay na siguro yan. Late na yan, ah. Malate na yan, pre, ah. Kyle TZ. As well on this one, once it gets the first item locked in, if he goes for something like the Blade of Hepatis, we're gonna see some big damage. So Albert's gonna have to be okay. careful. The rest of si Albert eh. so major effort. Oh, look at the damage! A big terrify keep here. Oh. Able to dash back, they're unable to find the kill, but we're already seeing the possibilities. Ayan, okay na ba? Mas, mas maliit na yung camera yeah, ko ah. Baka and, naman sabi niyo. <laughs> okay na ba yung Kim Noel ano? Videoga. First turtle like pre. Nice. Eston's gonna get involved here. Kyle TZ starting up on the lore, but a big stun on the boots. Reset, nice reset. But I see him slam and flap TZ already causing mayhem in the back line. That's the first turn. Kyle TZ will be able to secure it. Kyrie doing a little bit too much damage. Flap TZ might be too deep. Good job, good job. On to two members, Boots trying to steer him away, but now Kyle TZ making the move onto the orange, onto the purple buff and gonna steal that away. You know, I wasn't really even thinking about this, right? Like, uh, they're gonna collapse. But I did not see Boots pre. Well, vengeance, yeah, nah. Mm, nice one. Let's go, let's go. Well, I'm vengeance, yeah, pre. The glue, what AP Tapos brand plato. is utilizing the glue for right now is baba. to control Sarap. the neutral. Uy, nawala, nawala si... Split, split, and jump on to Kyrie, and if they can control Kyrie, they can control the game. I feel like that is their ulti ultimate... Tapang ni Plop, pre, oh. Split, split. Basag! Fruition. Oh, and not to mention... Yun lang, boy. Na-burst pa si Boots. Yun lang. AP Brand leading 3 and 0 right now. Pre, parang napanood ko na to ah. Gantong ganting sa M5 eh. Binubugbog si Boots. We've seen Ock in this position before though. 
But what they're going to need to try to turn things around is some big sets, some big plays. Albert, still in the game, hasn't gone down. But with AP Bren taking away that Tier 3 this early, Flap Tease is going to be able to move around the map so much more. Yeah, parang napanood ko na to guys parang alam na to ha <laughs> sustainability that he brings they've already taken all the gold plating and the tower which is what really is scaling them right now if AP is able to keep this up Onik is gonna have to find a response nakitray kay kagad gold again, oh aray ko best hmm bagi patay sunog sunog That's disgusting, bro. That is, that is, that is, this is looking a little rough. It's 4-0, 4,000 gold lead, four and a half minutes in. That's about a thousand gold. Dima full screen, boss. Dina makita score. Legit, paano ng dima full screen? Legit sa yo, ng dima full screen. But dito sa akin na po full screen ko. Wait nga lang, check ko nga. Na po full screen ko dito, boss. Eh. Micro steps that he's doing here. Ayan, ito, ito, full screen ako. Na po full screen ko, boss. Eh. Probably the tower itself. This is huge for AP Bren. Onik, they have to Ayan, no? naka full screen ako. Ito naman. And there's just, there's no jungle left. Naka full screen, boss. I mean, there, again, it could be anybody's game, but the snowball effect is definitely Ayan, no? in place Ayan, no? for Kita AP Bren. Lino nga eh. The Bren effect at its prime right now. The Bren effect, huh? The Bren effect. Man, and they're just, I mean, it's like... Because here's the thing, they they can always switch it Pakita up. Ng CP. They can really dominate you in the lane phase, or they can take a slow approach. They can oh, the you know, na, na full screen for it. They oh. the discipline of the Philippines, uh -oh. but the aggression of several other hungry regions ano na? out there. Oh, Hunter Strike na. They're willing to take things slow if they need okay, to. Okay, Domi. They're willing to be in your face at Gawin all times. Gawin ko nga ito minsan. You just never know Blowing what one first item you view, get. oh. It is true. It is true. I mean, that's not even pure rage. Yeah, medio. The difference in the game. Medio weird. You can kind of take a look yep. at some of the items. A okay, naman. Strike already secured by Kyle TZ, looking for that speed, just controlling the overall jungle, and you can see that he, ah, he was looking for that purple buff, but looking for a kill. No ga one pa boy. Yeah, no, no purple <laughs> for Kyrie. Oh, Yun lang man, sa itsa puso pre. Downhill for Onik. I again, I think it's. They're, they're gonna have give them that breathing room and it doesn't look like it right now. I mean one good thing going for Onyx right Shout now. Shout out to the legal BO brother Aaron, yeah, yeah, MJ say ga Gabo. Boy. Oi, hello sa MJ. Kumusta? From home credit. So Kyrie, Albert or Sons, if they can Ayano, is slide right mo pala pre para ma full screen mo. But it's gonna be a little while. Grabe mang zone si Plop, tira mo tapang oh. Really get the items they need. <laughs> si Boots parang minamasahe lang yung likod ni Plop TZ. That, that snowball effect is just in place now. AP Bryn are staying together. So again, I think Onyx Ayan na, pumapasok na. Pero si Plop TZ yung tapang talaga oh. If they don't, then they're gonna give up their life. So... We'll see again, again building off of what you were saying. Albert not dying is still What's a good that? thing. You got 4,600 gold versus 5,600 gold. A thousand gold difference between the gold lanes. And the Hareth is just only going to scale from this point onwards. You only can see a corrosive sight being picked up by Albert. Ako na lang shout out sa'yo. Shout out sa'yo. Sorry, wait lang ha. Nag-ano kami. Nag... Eh, ano na kasi, nag-start na kasi. Mamaya na ako mag-shoutout ng marami kapag uh, nakabreak na. Nag-start na eh, pre. Wait lang, kalmalogs lang, kalmalogs lang. <laughs> We'll have to wait until about the 10 to 11 minute mark for it to finally uh, come to... Boss, parang alam na to ha? Alam na to, bre ha? Alam na to ha? Chilang, chilang, chilang. The Dreadnought first got the breastplate in. Just got the War Axe in. Albert looking like he's going to finish the DHS soon. So that's good. He'll have the Corrosion. He'll have the DHS. Then it's just on your way... Best of five. Best of five po to. Best of five. Malalaman nyo na best of five. Doon sa may taas. Ito, toto. Yan o, yun. Yung, ano yung tatlong guhit 
Ibig sabihin, first to get three points, yung mananalo. Okay, yan. Ayan. Ibig sabihin, best of five siya. Huli, Ogwen. Buhay, pre, nakapaliker. Yun lang. Uray, kubis! AP Brand not able to cause the damage they wanted to. Sakit. Able to turtle up very well. Up D. Definitely in the first Lord coming down. I feel like this could be a turning point that if they were could possibly do something. Ang hap D pre. Ang hap D mo ba si? Sounds the only one that really doesn't have an ultimate at this point and. They might just try to bait. Ina ano hinehab abi ni Plaptizi. Nila pitan ko yung nagkaren eh. Nila pitan ko. Inab abi pre o. Ah, keyboy. Alaper libre ng Lord to pre. Patay ata si keyboy pre. Inla ay yatap 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 yatap. Patay. Able to pick up another kill. 3-0 and 1. Nolan's on fire right now. AP Brand takes the Lord. Onik just biting. Remind ko lang ha, wala pang basag na tore ha, guys ha. Guys, wala pang basag na tore, guys ha. Re-remind ko lang ha, wala pang basag na tore. Onik, galaw-galaw naman, pre. Pakiligin nyo naman ng AP Brand, kahit konti. Mount up a defense here. And I feel like that is what they need to do. Again, they're playing passive, not losing the key. Naka-flash na ba si Ogo? Hindi ko napansin. Flash na ba siya? Or nag-flash ba talaga siya? Parang hindi ko napansin eh. Lord sa top. May aura pa ito eh. May aura pa yung tore. Pinasok ni Plop. Gogi. Topong. Under the towers, though, taking a lot of hits to the face. Okay, a lot of damage on Ogwen as well. Not to defend the opponent. Yeah, na awa. Kaya lang si Marco pre, walang awa kay Marco. Into the back line with a blazing duet, looking for Super Marco. Super Marco drops him on his force, able to also get some more poke off. But Onik does defend without losing an inhibitor. This is what I was saying, right? Like Onik, they have, they have the heroes needed to defend. Gading Burits, di ba sa alis si Onik Rosers si Sida Bayo kasi alip po kaya lang may sakit ata siya, kaya di siya makapaglaro. Ah, wala walang flask. Naka ay ay yan flask na, naka flask na. Anti crash flask. Tapos. Plap 3 items na rin yun. Sabi corrosive strike daw. Corrosion sight yan. Corrosion sight. Nalito siya. Nihirap nito. Hirap na ito boss Hirap na ito Hindi naman napaano sila Napadread not armor sila Kasi kaya silang tunawin ni Kyle TC Makes a major factor in the play The real problem is definitely Gonna be Keyboy here Medyo mahirap to ha He's very behind About 35 Wala kasi nga ako kay Super Marco dito eh Pure yan eh Harit Pure pa yan pre Hirap yan eh tapos kung physical damage naman, sobrang taas ng early physical damage nila kasi naka-Nolan sila. Hirap talaga bitawan Nolan. Napansin ko nga parang isa sa mga top, ano eh, top bans itong Nolan. Hirap to. Up, up. AP, now actively backing up. Nice plays from over the side onto Onik here. Purple buff, sama-sama sila. Okay. Pastor Echo, pasok. Ogwin. Ay, ay, tunaw ata si Ogwin, pre. Yun na, walang jungle. Nasa ni Iban. Pre-lord, pre. Pre-lord to. We'll see if they can do it. This is going to give Lord over to the side of AP Bren. Onik without a retribution. Ang bilis o. Less than 10 seconds yung Lord, pre. They're just melting this Lord at this point. AP Bren. Less than 10 seconds, pre, yung Lord. Nangyari sa inyo, boss. Yatap tayo dyan, boss. Basag yung top. Pero wala nang aura. Luminous pa. 
the war axe as well. So they are gearing up. They are getting the equipment that they need. Pati si Albert, hindi rin siya makaano eh. Kahit makakuha siya ng maraming items dyan, kailangan niya maihampas. Hiling ka pag namatay ka agad si Pew, basic eh. Pero nagtira mo si Pew ah, bumuo siya ng... Ano? I mean, Bumuo ng blade armor. <laughs> Boom! Oh, yan na, pre. Oh, yan na. Kyrie, pre, patay. Si Marco. Sakit ni Albert, pre. Tunaw mo. Sakit to. Bumabalik yung ano sa blade armor. Nakita mo? Bumabalik yung damage. GG's. GG's, GG's, GG's. GG's Ano yun pre? Naita mo diba? Sinasalo ni Plop pre Sinasalo ni Plop TZ yung damage Delay sa MNO Delay itong 10 seconds Sorry hindi ko na natanggal eh Nag start na kasi yung broadcast eh wala, wala na akong magagawa. Delay ng 10 seconds. Eh. Sorry, Arlene. Octavio, pasensya na. Wait lang ah. Saglit ah. Kukuha lang ako ng mga pupuds natin. Sorry, delay, dun sa, delay, delay dito sa akin. Delay. 8 seconds na delay yung stream ko sa ibang stream. Brought, Onik was unable to do anything about it. Most definitely. I mean, just overall, they did a great job. Onik taking a look at some of these replays. AP Bren completely controlling the pace. And even at around 10 minutes, when Onik did start to like put up some fights here and there, it still was not enough. They needed definitely another 10 minutes or more to be able to compete here. They needed a lot more time to be able to even uh, make it, G. Definitely, and I mean, we can just see uh, Onik trying to hold on with every crash that they possibly could into this game. Well, I just feel like the major factor was that the glue just came in clutch Ooh. so much for AP Bryn, and you can just see they they again the R lot Keyboy did try to make some key plays, but it just wasn't there as AP Bryn was just scaling and snowballing. This was another take right here. They were just not allowing Kyrie to get the buffs that he was needed. And then look, the split split, just too much for Onik at this point. And then this would have been the final oh. siege, if I'm not mistaken. God, yeah. look at that. The the, the, the layers of, of uh, CC there, the layers of crowd control there with few bringing in the Guardian, getting the big knockup, then Ogwen getting the Minoan's Fury. Onik did not have an answer to all that. And because they fell behind, it was just far too much. They did a valiant effort at defending it, but AP Bren, the Bren effect strikes, and there just wasn't a way in. <laughs> it's nighttime now in the digital arena, but the bots <laughs> are still watching. If you guys are out there at all watching, big shout out to all of you. Let's take a look at the MVP Flap TZ109 on a glue. Hey, I, again, 47% of his team damage or the damage taken, which is crazy. So not only was he the DPS, he was also the tank. So he was just again the who just came in clutch. I mean it kinda countered the CC. Like the CC it split the damage between a lot of the minions. It was just overall such a wild pick, but actually came into clutch. Could have been something they were just planning. Like I said, if there's any moment, the grand finals is the moment you pull out all the stops. There's a lot of money on the line. Boss, game one palang ah, game one palang yan guys ah, game one palang. I mean, it works similar to what. Game one palang yan, game one. Okay, shout out M. Okay, but then I'm gonna shout out. Inaka ako dito. 
know, with Kyrie Babe, I know. Okay, brethren, okay. something like that that wants to walk in, it makes it very tough. And we saw it at the very first turtle. Um, Kyrie was not able to get an angle. He was over by the tri bush. Flap is there waiting for him, getting the stun, then the grab grab, and just completely denied Kyrie from being able to get into. Kalaba lang tayo, ha? Easy lang, easy. Okay, shout out muna tayo. Shout out sa. Shout out pala kay ano, kay MJ Saiga Boy. Shout out sa Legal BO ng HC. Shout out po sa mga taga legal. Oh, mga nakaka basketball ko yan eh. 'Di ba? Naalala niyo ba 'yan? Ginawang libro yung Onyx, basa-basa na kasi ng brand sabi ni John Paul tag tag liga. Well, to be fair, ha, maganda naman yung lineup ng Uh, uh, Onik Pero kasi ang tinitingnan ko dun is Nathan eh Di ba naalala nyo sabi ko Nathan Pwede Nathan dun sa Lineup na yon Pero hindi, hindi, hindi ko alam ha Kasi sila naman yun eh <laughs> game, game nila yan eh Di ba So sila yun Sila yun Sila yun nakakaintindi nung Draft or nung roster Pero Ba't di pinapakita emblem nila Hindi ko alam eh Then it moved on to more sure. things. Di ko alam. Ako hinuhulaan ko lang kung baka yun yung emblem. Mga tier 3 emblems lang yun nakikita. Yung mga nasa gilid. Diba? Shout out sa girlfriend ko na si Rogeline Saut. Sabi ni Kim Kim Emil Clasio. Shout out sa'yo Rogeline. Yan. Oy Kim, magpakabait ka. Alam ko mabait ka. Yan na yan. Shout out John Kenneth Resima. Shout out Richard Mark Rabano. Lista mo na yan. Lista na natin. Shout out uh, Archie Natinga. Shout out Erloy. Shout out kay Carl Joseph Pabilio. Hello sa iyo tol. Kumusta? Magandang gabi. Moyax Lagindam. Shout out sa iyo bro. Shout out Pabs Pangag. Hello po kay Pabs Pangag. <laughs> Dabog pa lang ni Plop 'yon, wala pang sunog. Oo nga eh. Binan niyo nga Xborg, 'di ba, nung game 1? Nakaban eh. Sabi ni Doktor na taga San Cabos, taga Pasig, Pasig po, Pasig. Taga dito ako sa Pasig. <laughs> Sorry ah, uh, ano, delay po tong live na to ngayon ko lang nakita kasi 'di ba lagi ako nag lagi ako nag AML stream. <laughs> Yung pusa niya. Guest star on the stream. I'm telling you. Who do you think's gonna win? No, Kat, what do you think? Uh, I think uh, she said AP Bryn, you know. Fan of the beast. I'm joking, I'm joking. Yeah. Jarat Maxol, hello saya. Bina lagi bagi Donny Flap sama dengan X Gamer TV. Bunga eh, non lala, pre lala. Sabi ni Jacqueline sakitan. Shout out Idol Team Cibugang, nang Miss True Toda Antipolo. Mangan taga Antip, shout out sama mangan taga Antips, sama mangan Rizalians. <laughs> sa mga taga Rizal <laughs> Rizalians kasi tao ko sa mga taga Rizal eh. Yan si Alam yung mga taga Rizal na casters sa MPL si Hans si Wolf yeah mga taga Rizal yan eh, Napunta na kasi ako kila Hans dati Pakashout daw sabi ni Kurt Neba Nerbal Hello sa iyo Kurt <laughs> Akala ko mag XB na si Plop hindi pa pala. Hindi nakaban yung X, yung XB actually. Alex Michael Villanueva PH, PH here. I want Onik to win, but I want to see if Kyrie will cry if they lose. Most likely ay uh, iiyak yan. <laughs> Broadcast mo na ba? Say ako na sila. Ayun yeah, sila. Sabi ni Pro Kicks Esports, pa shout out po kay Kian at Kiel na nanonood from UK. Shout out sa mga Shout out to all of the friends that you're there at UK. Hello, shout out to you guys. Mas mahaba pa yung paghihintay ng laro kaysa sa mismong laro. Sabi ni Brian Romasok. Pero, again, hahawakan ko pa rin yung, ano ha, hahawakan ko pa rin yung prediction ko ha. 3-2 tong laman na to. AP Bren, 3-2. Okay? Hindi ko alam kung mag susunod-sunod mo na 2-0 to, tapos makakahabol ng 2-2. Kasi gano'n yung nangyari sa M5, di ba? Naalala nyo ba? Di ba? Gano'n yun eh. Yung nangyari, shout out Raffi Pamilara. Hello. Iyak na naman yan, sabi ni Boss J. Oy, pero mabait yan si Kyrie ah. Uh, na-meet ko na kasi siya. Uh, ilang beses ko na siya na-meet, personal. Mabait. Mabait siya. 
Okay, na-shoutout na kita Rapi ha, huwag ka na mag-spam. Angel TV, shoutout kay Ang Angelbert sa Uro. Hello po. Hello sa'yo, uh, Jason. Hello kay uh, Algatani Bungalos. Hello sa'yo, John Carl Umandam, Eduardo Peralta. Si Mitch San Diego, hello po, shoutout. Shoutout, ang dami, ang dami na dito, shoutout sa inyo. Bakit lagi napipiling ngayon yung Bigsana, pinalakas ba? Yup, 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 malakas ang Bigsana ngayon. Ah, uh, ang layo ng, ang layo ng range ng mga skills niya, tapos, sakit din. <laughs> so, isa siya sa mga meta heroes ngayon. Yung nana na nerf na, same with, Aurora, pero malalakas pa rin yung mga heroes na yun. Shoutout sa kapitan namin, sabi ni Boss BJ. Shoutout sa kapitan nyo, kung tagasan ka ba pre, para ma-shoutout natin yung kapitan mo. Sabi ni Mele Liwag, Lods, pa-shoutout from Japan, love Raselia Lasingero. Mag-inom tayo! Mag-inom tayo! <laughs> Pero ngayon, hindi na ako nag-iinom. Muna, kasi sa lunes mag-iinom kami nila, Wolf. Sorry, naka-headband naka naka ako kasi tinatangay ng... May fan, may fan kasi ako dito sa taas. Tapos tinatangay yung buho ko. So, so nag-headband ako. Yeah. Pang... Ang tulog na hairball. <laughs> ano, grabe Discord nila mo ba siya? Puro anti-PH talaga. Uy, oh, speaking of Discord pala, wait lang. Sali pala ako. Andun pala sila Joshi King sa Discord. Wait lang, sasali ako. Shout out sa mga taga Valenzuela. Uy, alam mo ba, ma ano, may, may, fam, may mga friends ako at saka relatives sa Valenzuela. Shout out sa inyo, sa mga taga Valenzuela. Lahat ng mga taga Valenzuela matatapang tsaka pogi. Okay. Tsaka quick trivia lang ang Valenzuela ay parte ng Bulacan before. Okay? Para lang sa nakakalam. <laughs> Shout out from uh, General Trias Kibite. Hello, hello sa iyo, Jang Laot. Boss BJ, hello sa iyo. Sa mga taga Pangasinan, shoutout din po. Sabi ni MJ, miss you brother Aaron ha. Si brother Cap, legit ng kapitan ngayon sa barangay nila. Oo nga eh, no? nakakagulat. Nonsense, hello. Shoutout from KSA. Hello, hello po. Kanina may tagariyad dito eh. Hello po, hello po sa inyo. So ilang minuto po kaninang break. Ah, hindi ko alam. Siguro mga 30 minutes. Try mo nga po mag-cast ngayon. <laughs> Wag na. Ano na. Pahinga natin, pre. Pahinga natin. Shout kay Uwe, taga Valenzuela yun. Oo nga. Ay, nakakalaro ko yan sila, Uwe Basketball. Nakakalaro ko sila dito sa QC. Last week, naglaro... Ah, hindi pala last week. Last, last week, naglaro kami nila, Uwe. Kasama ko sila, Master of the Basics. Yeah. Basketball kami. Si Uwe, si Kimpoy, si Sensui. Si Kimpoy, ang bilis. Ang lakas ng resistensya, pre. Kimpoy, takbo ng takbo. Bas, ano, shoutout sa SK namin. Liga naman at ML Tournament. Let's go. Wala, wala ba si Coach Yeb? Hindi ko sure, eh. Hindi ko sure, eh. Sabi ni Offlane, shoutout sa, ano, shoutout din boss from Palawan, hello po sa taga Palawan. Rai Kaliwag, boss pa shoutout kami ng wife ko, si Nestle. Ang ganda ng pangalala ng wife mo, Nestle. Let's go. Shoutout sa, ano, sa Riyadh, sa mga taga Riyadh, sabi ni Robert Gregorio, mag 5am na yan sa KSA. Ang nga pala, galing Saudi to si Noel. Ito si Noel, galing Saudi to. Johan Official TV, sana makapagkas ka sa M6 Idol kasama sila Manjin. Oo naman, oo naman. Lagi naman tayong ganun pre. Nandito pa rin ako nananahimik. Ayan, ito, 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 si Chick. Siya yung taga, ano, taga Riyadh. Hello sa'yo. Boss J, boss, pa-shoutout. Datamax po. Datamax, school ba yan yung Datamax? Ay, hindi, Datamax pala yun, pre. Champion kanina sa MCL. Hello, sa mga champion sa MCL, shoutout sa inyo. Hindi <laughs> ako nakapag-MCL kanina, pre. Busy. Alam nyo kung saan ako nabibisi ngayon? Sa NBA Infinite. Puisit yung NBA Infinite na yun, nalalason ako. Nice idol, di kayo snabero pa shoutout. Oh naman, Jacqueline Sakitan, ba't naman tayo magiging snabero? Natatawa ako, that, nag, kasi di ba nagla-livesim ako lagi sa TikTok? Lagi, ito sa YouTube and TikTok. Bihira, actually bihira lang ang kakastart ko lang mag-livesim sa YouTube. Eh. Pero, 
majority ng time ko ng live stream is sa TikTok. May may nagme-message doon sa akin, taga dito lang pala sa amin, malapit. Sabi sa akin, boss, taga dito lang ako sa ganyan ganyan. Naiya lang ako tawagin ka kapag dumadaan ka. Kasi kapag nandito ako sa bahay, nakasando lang ako, naka-boxer shorts, alam mo 'yun. Tapos bibili ako ng kung ano-ano man diyan sa kanto namin. <laughs> 11.49 na shout out from Mexico yan. shout out sa mga taga Mexico Pampanga, hello po ang Hell TV, boss po shout out sa buntis kong asawa Christy Argile hello po AP Brent, 3-1 yan kasi si Albert naglalaro din lang si Albert ha, din lang si Albert malang si Albert Jasia, hello sa'yo Ma- Jasia Ma- Maraasin Oy mga tagriyad, magsama-sama tayo sa MSC Uy. <laughs> Oo nga, kita-kits. Kayo, magkita-kits kayo. Oh, hindi pa natin sure eh. <laughs> kung pupunta kami dyan. Sir Zach, shoutout Idol. Watching here from Calamba habang gumagawa ng lesson plan. Sir Zach, shoutout sa'yo. Ito na, magsisim- nagsimula na pre. Okay, medyo lay low muna tayo sa shoutout ha. Ano muna tayo? Nod muna tayo pre. Nod muna tayo. Bakbakan na to pre. Okay, first three bands. Para Miss Minotaur tsaka Matilda. Puro utilities ang tinatanggal ng Onyx. No? Kasi doon magaling ang AP bread eh. Pero open ang Grok. Tanggalan Joy, Nolan, ano pa ba pwede tanggalin? Uh, okay. Ah... Navaria? Okay. Okay, Navaria. Onik, anong first pick ng Onik? Pwede yung unang Arlot? Guinevere. Ay, Guinevere. Okay. Benevere. Ruby, available Ruby. Pwede sila mag-Ruby. Ruby plus one. Ruby plus mage. Feeling ko. Ruby plus mage. Hmm. Uh, dependent on their comp here so they the AP brain could go for more of a strategic comp here do a little bit more like you know Ruby no uh, sa akin na Ruby or Arlot Ruby Arlot Ruby or Arlot tapos plus mage ayan na mage na vexa na tapos Ruby or Arlot para safe gusto mo yung tago syempre yung jungle mo baka pwedeng sa ano sa ayan Ruby Ar- uh, Arlot ko kunin lang Arlot sa kabila naman, pwede sila mag... Aha. Uh-huh. Kuha na sila ng marksman, I think. Ay, hindi. Sila mag-harit. Pwede sila mag-harit. Harit sila. Masyadong maraming mages, pero... Flexi pa rin naman. Pwede sila mag-harit dito. Harit. Ruby harit. Ay, Ruby. Harit Harit Or Nana Nana Yun Nana Galing 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 Na predict Yun Nana Ano kaya hero nila Pwede drain kaya to Barats Wait lang sorry Lakasan natin Mahina pa lang Boses nila Yan Yan Medyo malakas na ba Wait lang ha Papakinggan ko Hindi ko kasi marinig eh Iba yung narinig ko dito Baka iba rin sa broad Kasi Pahingan ko lang Or you know something like that. Of course, they they pick up the Claude, which again I feel like is a really good play into this. But it's gonna it's gonna be a very like you okay, have to be super okay, precise dinik, dinik. with the Claude with dealing with a, a, a Nana, a Ruby, <coughs> and a Guinevere at this point. This is this is wild. And now into the second phase of bans, AP Brand gonna take out the Clint. Hmm. Onik okay, on the other hand, they need to focus in on to junglers. Maybe roamers, so, maybe it's a bit more Layo open on the field. I think junglers could be the route to go. Um, trying to think of what Sobrang can give problems ng mic ko, to the Sorry. Guinevere. Um, and again, it's like, <laughs> it's tough because AP Brand could literally pick anything and I wouldn't be like, eh, okay, I don't know X-Borg. about that. Okay, um, they're going to ban out the X-Borg. Uh, <laughs> they ban out something like the Fred. Do they ban out something like the Akai? They're not going to be able to do it. They're not going to be able to do it. 
Um, a lot of possibilities. Mag- Maybe they may not tanggal uli ng gold. Tanggal uli ng isang I gold. I felt like the Tigreal would have been like a really good go for Onyx last time. Like it, it, even though they were they picked the R lot early. Uh, again, they Goldie. still could flex the R lot on AP Bryn. I just felt like Kasi ang next na, a good ang first solid pick CC naman dyan at saka last pick AP Bryn. Eh. So pwedeng tanggal sila ng Marksman. Arlot, right? Tapos, yun na, Bruno. Tanggal sila ng isang Marksman. Tapos AP Bryn, pwedeng maging kuha muna sila ng Tiger. The one one? I mean, there's the Fred Rill. Okay. Ganda ng ban ng Fred Rill. With no Clamp, no Bruno. He could okay, go Brody, he could go Grill. one one he could go Ixia. I mean, there's still tons of Ty Marksmen out there. Grill. He Grill. could pick up the Harith. Um, Ty Grill mo na. Ty Grill pre. We've seen before, I'm pretty sure. So, and that's what AP Bren went last time. daming mage so kasi ng Oni kapag... Uy, CC pre. Okay, Rome. Arla. So, I'd like to see something a bit more physical. Tago pa rin. Open. Pwede pa Barats dito pre, ha? I mean, they they could possibly pa, sa go for. Dito. Of, of course, there's there's quite a few options. I mean, you're gonna have to deal with this Claude Smolder. So some type of dive hero. Parte. I mean, if Onyx is comfortable natin. taking a Lapu, there it is. Uh, and then run in yeah, into yeah, yeah, a carry. Yeah, yeah. I mean, their carry is a little wild. Uh, I mean. It's going to be pretty good for against the lot. Yeah, yeah exactly. I mean, they're going to have the front line. They have the, the control and Barats. the CC. I, it could scale really well here. Barats. Yeah, definitely. I mean, they, they this time, they definitely have the wall to protect Alam mo na carry. Kaya, Pag nakadamage si Black Easy, they alam mong front line ang hero ni Kyle. Four out of five front of their heroes hero all have some sort of heavy CC yan. that can Wala hit multiple people Barats. at once. Um, here's the big Baksha. scary thing Barats for AP or Brand. Baksha. I guess, no, they already have... Um, They already have EXP and uh, and Rome locked ano in. Ano na pre, Barats or Bakshi lang yan. Ay, Akai yun. There goes the Akai. Akai. Okay. Yung formula ng AP Bren, kapag right. nakadamage I mean, hero si Flap, mag, for that front nagtatank line. hero uh, siya. No? Between our lot and Akai. Help and and Akai. help with retributions, yun help with, uh, <laughs> with those control objectives. It's, it's a nice Good luck answer. Good luck daw sa Echo, sabi ni Wala Echo dito. Fritz, Sayuri, or Beso. Nothing that Onyx has right now is going to slow him down. Nah, it's an overall good comp. I like both sides. I can't okay, say that I pick one over the other, but Trax, send us into the land of dawn. <laughs> We're going. Yes, sir. We're going to go into the land of dawn now. <laughs> This is going to be Onik trying to redeem themselves after a very rough game Bakit number one. Na na AP Uy, just Jaya. trying to keep Mo, the pace. Na. It's 1-0 right now nana. in a best of five at the grand finals of Games of Future. G, do we think with the draft that Onik has brought, Sorry, masyadong, ano, can they handle this? Can okay they lang turn yan. the tides right here? Can they turn 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 the tides right here? We got chess piece on the board here. Para siya sa like fair it. use. Kasi... This is... Sa YouTube ah, sa mga hindi nakakala ng YouTube kasi parang dapat nagko-comment ako sa mga ano, sa nangyayari. Kasi ang mga ang magiging problema niyan, baka madali yung YouTube ko. Stop laughing. So, tell me about, yeah. tell me about the win conditions, G. Alright, Onik the side of Kaltizi <laughs> i think this could be the great option that they need we can already see again flap tz is just Easy. absolutely insane easy bugatti but uh, pero may palag ngayon ng onik ah mas maganda ang damage nila mas strip ko tong lineup na to stopping flap tz from controlling that exp maybe show some pressure up there instead of the gold lane as we don't see it being a, a major problem in the gold last time we seen the exp fall first and they look like that's what might happen again as the pressure is being applied up there by the side of AP Bryn. Again, I think if they just keep up the aggression, keep up the farm, keep it going, that they have the claws to secure the late boss, game. They have the solid CC, the heavy natin. spin, combined with the Vexana. Four na si Kairi. Just control Pwede the silang... overall team fights. Don't Pwede get them off guard, though, because eh. Onyx has the, the CC and the control to stop AP Bryn's aggression. Kyrie missing that, though. That's a little rough right there. That's a mistake you don't want to make. I mean, it does... It still sends few back. It still does a little bit something there. So I mean, we're definitely. Definitely doesn't feel as stompy Kyle. as AP Brand. 
May jump yeah. to si Kaya Ryu. Three pa lang si Plump eh. Pwede nga nilang mamain. Yung ginagawa nila. Gusto nila mag-minus one dun. Or Plump. Ang mag-poor si Plump. Makauna sila. Kill. Okay. Look at Onik coming out on top. The Kings looking really good this time around. I think I found it easy to take on AP Bryn again. That's just the early game control that Guinevere uh -oh. brings. And then look at the CC and the control. Now the biggest thing that we'll want to watch out for here is that no, no, Kaltz yeah, no. picking up the Kai. Na, na, the, the Nana definitely counters that heavy spin. So Sans could be waiting to throw out the Molina to be able to stop Yan lang Kaltz. Kasi yung heavy spin now it's just going to come down to Onik. Like, yeah, you secure okay, kills, check but now you're going to have Top to start boots. working on neutral objectives. We can already see the carry picking up the Thunderbolt. Thunder there's so a good Albert. Bit de defensive, so it looks like kind of like the tank carries coming out on the side. Oh, here. Heavy spin on the key. Get up, see big. Oh, big pin on the key. Kyrie gonna try to come out. Hey, boy, boy, go. Boy, still alive, able to dodge the final slash. Uh, and they will Mitch. get away. Uh. Onik feeling much more comfortable in game number two. Definitely, and again, that's <laughs> the, the kill. Lead. Yeah, but see, Albert, but I at that. Hold on, the Molina okay, blitz. Open. And the kill on to Ogwen. Sans putting another one in the book there. 2-0 in one. He's playing such a cleaner game than last time. I think this is going to be critical. Making sure... This is what we went back to the basics, man. We all know this little girl Nana is meta. We all know the Vex is meta. We know the things in AP Bren is not forgetting it. Onik needs to get back to the roots of that. And we're seeing that in game number two. And it's already working very well. I like it. I mean, but Onik, they... Don't get tunnel vision. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You are facing AP Bryn. The gold lead's not crazy, even though it's 4-0. Keep the eye on the prize. Secure the neutral objectives. Keep controlling them. Keep their speed down. And on it, keep controlling this game like this. Now, we are seeing the next turtle take coming in. Do we see AP Bryn make this? Okay, five man. Five man. Finally, take a turtle here. Fury Plop, Fury Plop. Wait a second, but a big pin does land on a keyboard, but he's able to just get away. AP Brandon looking boots into the back side with Brave Spider. Going to get hit by the heavy spin. Kyle Teasy looking for an angle. Nice Kyle. Nice Kyle. Nice Kyle. Nice Kyle. Nice Kyle. Nice Kyle. Onik, good job, good job. Unable to secure a big neutral objective just yet. Still holding a small lead in gold, but AP Bren is keeping up. Yeah, I mean, they, they saw that turtle. They came and they conquered that turtle. AP Brand coming out on top in that go around. Brett, three man school. pet, pure pa yan eh. Baka mahuli. You can kind of see. Uh -oh. Albert, 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 Albert. Oh, nice Winter one. Dashing, gets final slash, picks boy. up the kill, Keyboy. Ah, looking for something, ah, looking ah, for ah, an ah, angle ah, onto Ogwen. Gonna get the I'm offended onto him. Kyrie coming in to help out. Dash is in. Yeah, May dash pa. For another Wala nang dash. Ogwen. May be able to get away from this. Kyrie still trying, but out comes Kyle Teasy from the bush. Kyrie knows he can't get it. He's got to back off. Parang malas yung bagong hero sa Ben Quinn. Hindi naman. Lakas lakas ng bagong hero pa. As AP Bryn just holding their own again. Nakamahan ako. Pinapawisan yung pinikili ko. And I feel like this is where they need to find the momentum to re-pressure AP Bryn. You can kind of already see Boots on the Lapu putting on a lot of pressure on the Flap TZ. And again, this goes to show that the XPs are kind of equal at this point. We're not seeing too much of an early rotation. Turtle now going down down to the bottom lane. I feel like the 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 biggest problem on it just ran into is that Albert fell, right? Into the little bit of the early game. A tank carry, that's not what you want. That's definitely not what you want. He's already a level behind Super Marco right now. Super Marco getting the gold from mid and the bot there. Albert does get some shots out of that tower, but it's still nothing major here. Okay, we're not sure, we're not sure. We just need to get a golden stop with Super Marco. One, two, three, four, 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 one, two,
Yeah, I mean, oh, objective muna tayo pre ah. Kain. Ganda ng skin ng ano na yan, Greeny Bear man. Now, what I really need to see from the side of Bilis Onik is science, yun. man. We need to see that, that Melina oh, Blitz just absolutely flap, flap. devastated. Fury, nagamit. Nagtali na, tumali na. Tumali na si Flap. Kyrie keeping his angle. Boots with the bravest fighter in the backside. On a few once again. Ayun, si Flap na kukuha, bre. Patay ba? Patay, patay, patay. Umbuhay pa si Boots. Oh my god. Ooh, ubus. Naka, bes. Papasukin na, bre. Ubus, wipe out. They found you out, no hiding to death. It's a full five-man white. Let's go. Brand taking the wheel. Nice one, nice one, nice one, nice one. Such, such great positioning by Super Marco. This is what I'm saying. Kind of keep an eye on him. He's staying on the far right. But no, no, from Skyboots, ah. You know, we're not poor. We're talaga si Piu. Flaptizi was able to kill the turtle. The retries didn't even matter. Na nakap sila. Papalo up sana sila kay Boots. Na nakap sila nung ano? With the blazing duet that just. Pierced the back line of Onik there, and it was just one, two, three, four, and five down. They don't believe I know what's the plan. I mean, they're they're kind of thinking. This Vexana has been hiding under the blanket for a while now. A lot of teams haven't been focusing her, but AP Bren picks her up every time for a reason. The damage is there, the CC is there. You get an extra hero on the map, and now Keyboy is in trouble. The damage is locking on. Kyrie jumps in, looking for the final record, looking for Super Marco, but unable to find him, denied, and taken out from Ogwin. No, the destination si is Boots. coming from AP Bren. They're closing in. Boots looking for something, and Onyx seems to be panicking. AP Bren back on the aggressive route, back onto what we saw in game one. Once they smell blood, oh once they take a bit Sakin of oxygen, gra, there's nothing left. Boots is the next to fall. Super Marco looking for the 1v1. Let's bring it, Albert. Ooh. AP Bren feeling good about themselves right now. Sans next. They're the <laughs> They're glued to them. Onik falling down, crumbling right now. And I, this is where I feel like AP Brin always just flicks the switch, right? They just flick the switch, right? And now they're going to be able to get three items, na three items to Simarco, pa apat na. They're going to be able to get this Lord probably. Gagawin ko ayon, gagawin ko masi pio. Nakadimon boots, tapos naka ano? Naka glowing one. We're gonna need to be able to stop a a great siege, though I don't think this Lord's gonna make it or break it. It's not enhanced, but again, they don't want to trade their life for measly little towers. The Bren effect is real, and it is definitely a switch. Whether it comes at 20 seconds in the game, whether it comes at seven minutes in the game, ten minutes in the game, you know, at some point, AP Bren is gonna make their move, and once they do, it's like they immediately just go from chill to hyper aggressive, and just all over. And then once they get to that, it is so hard. Na pagaling talaga ni Super Marco magkulod eh, no? Sobrang tapa. Alam mo yung kaya Calculated risk. Ang tapang niya, pero alam niya na, na ano, alam niya na kailangan niya ng tumakas. Mga ganun. Hindi nag-greedy. Kahit sobrang late ng buhay ng kalaban, hindi rin niya pinapasok. Kapag hindi niya kayang patayin at maubos na yung duration. Oh, wait lang. Si Pew. Lalim ni Pew. Si Boots. Yung nga yung sinasabi ko, kahit sobrang late na ng buhay ng kalaban, basta mauubos na yung BMI niya. Bumabalik talaga siya. Ganun siya kadisiplinado. Wow. Harassing a lord, still marching down the top side, and it's ten seconds until Kyrie is back into the land of dawn. Lord will finally go down. AP Bren still not withholding their assault. Super Marco gonna get one last shot in onto the inhibitor, and AP Bren lets them breathe for a second. Hingam na hingam na. King of comeback, sabi. But dapat na si Chewy. Wala si Chewy. May sakit dada si Chewy. Kaya hindi naman si si Albert ang ano eh, ang magiging problema eh. Yung buong team yung nagkakaroon ng problema dito ng Onyx. Yung buong team na lang. Okay. Demon Hunter Sword na si Albert. Nag-damage siya. Okay. 
heavy spin just Which is good kasi yung kukunat niya kailangan mo ng pang-sure so Corrosion, stra- Now, uh, corrosion side, de- Demon Hunter Sword. <laughs> Kyrie has one items mix and bits of multiple other items. And can still play though. Kiboy, 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 kiboy. Kiboy, conceal din siya. Kiboy, kiboy, kiboy. 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 The recalls come out. The taunts are there. When AP Bren gets in this in this vibe, man, we saw it the other day in the winning clip. Mukhang, <laughs> mukhang alam na to, bre, ah. Screaming, man. The man was yelling. He was talking smack. He was feeling himself. Ayun, tinan mo pinansusun niyo ito yung Godfrey, oh. Once again, it's the Bren up back. AP Bren moving in. The Molina Blitz comes out, but it's not stopping him today. AP Bren takes an inhibitor. They back off. It's okay, may natutunan ako ngayon. May natutunan ako sa deck sana ngayon. First item, Glowing Wand. Kasi yung apoy-apoy pala nun, tumatama dun sa ano. Kahit dun sa Eternal Guard, pre. Uy, si Plop na palalim. Napatapak ng Cyclone ay pre. Oh my god. 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 Oh my a bulky boy right there not someone you want to go up against few getting back onto the map now lord is delayed on it by some time but discipline there by super marco to not take that kill he is 5 only 6 doesn't want to allow the shutdown might as well work on securing his stacks looks like they might trade and give him the blue buff buti na lang nakatulong si Sans may passive pa naman si Sans nothing really comes out of it just yet again Looks like AP Brin might be eh. just utilizing this Lord as a bait. Nah, no, they've zoned Lana. him out. Onik just Kailangan gives nila it up. What legit. in the world? Yeah. What is they going on? Man. Pero wala pang basag na tore ha, gusto ko lang sabihin ha. Wala pang basag na tore guys. Wala pang basag na tore, okay? We need a little bit more time. And this time, we can't make the mistake, we can't let them in, we can't get cut off. They have to watch out for those big plays that AP Bren likes to bring. Last time, it was the combo between Vexana and uh, Minotaur. This time, it's going to be mm-hmm. Kyle Teasy, the final slash from Ogwen, and still uh, Vexana yeah, getting the big knockout. As long as they can watch out for some of those hits, they can definitely survive this, but it's not going to be easy. Flicker na lang para pala. That was a good utilization of the magic century there. I think they're just going to take as many tier threes as they possibly can. Mabilis na matutunan yun, Lord. Uy, si Mark! Up the base a little bit more. Super Marco so low. That is a win for the side of Onik. That's going to allow them to have a little bit of breathing room as he needs to heal up. So an engage probably not going to be happening here by Aki Brin. No, 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 no. He is full HP. We might see an engage now. Boots into the backside once again. Boots is like, listen, you guys tell me I'm going, bro. You guys want me to do it? I'm going. Boots has no fear. And you know, I've heard Mirko talk about it before. Like, Boots is the XP learner who's just willing to do it. He's willing to die for the team. And whether you think it's a bad play or not, his plays have been helping Onik out. The last fight that they almost won, Boots was the starter of her, almost able to take out few. Again, Onik just needs a little bit more time that when Boots makes those plays happen, mahira pa, mahira pa, mahira pa. capitalize on it. Yeah, I mean, give it up to Onik, though. I mean, they 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 were able to hold that so well, and the Molina Blitz was just constantly taking Super Marco down to like 10% HP. If Boots is able to do that. Ayan na. But he's getting chipped away by Marco. Oh, Kyle Teasy goes down finally. A Bravest Fighter lands on a Super Marco. Albert now with Speedy Light Wheel. Looking for a target. Looking for someone to lock on to. AP Bren knows that with Kyle Teasy being gone, they've lost some of the front line. It's time to back up. Off. Boss, bakit wala live yung Pinas po? Ay, ah, yung Tagalog. Yeah, meron, meron Tagalog. May Tagalog broadcast. Point, right? Just keep buying time. Maybe secure meron some Tagalog of the neutral broadcast, objectives eh. that are still standing. Like we can kind of see pushing Pwede the minions ako, to do a tower takedown here. Meron Tagalog broadcast, pre. Ooh, Kyrie. He's okay. Not He's okay. Not able to do too much. I was hoping he was going to make a good pl- pick. No. I think I, you, that's one, one of the downfalls of the Gwen is like, If you're by yourself, like once you go in, you're sitting there, man. Ito, wait you lang ah. Ni Tagalog bro, guys, legit. Ayun oh. Wait lang ah. Ito. Papakinggan niyo. Papa ng branding board na to, mahihirapan na talaga silang depensahan 'yan. 'Di ba? Ingan tsaka si Brigid ata. Ayun oh. 
Eh, may, may, may Tagalog broadcast nga, legit, legit. Pwede nyo check dun sa mismong ano, kung, kung gusto nyo ma, ano, kung gusto nyo ng Tagalog. Meron, meron. I feel like the difference here is that Kyle oh. Teezy's 15 and Kyrie's not oh. having a little bit of trouble in the jungle. Si Ingan tsaka si Brigida. They don't have Albert up here yet either. They might want to try to take the slow. I think Meron, oh, meron, meron, may Tagalog. Play on a flat Teezy. Ayan. But he is able to use the purify and get away okay. there. Okay, nice. Okay, damage yeah. back. Sipio, boy, pa. Taking too much. Albert trying to lock on Oakwin. Gonna be able to flicker back. It's still a battle for the Lord. Pit. Pang, it it. Maybe through. knows they're outmatched here. They're gonna have to back mm. off once again. Unable to get a kill. They get few down so low every time, but can't get the finishing hit. You have to capitalize on some of them, man. That's the. That's like I've seen Super Marco low twice now, Flap Cheesy and Pew. Like this is, it's rough. Sa cha like, saang channel? Dito sa ano? Them, Wait, this be even more breathing room, but free. now a full team comp of AP Bryn sieging down Games of the Future MLBB. 10K gold lead. Can they survive? Wait lang, mamaya na, mamaya na. Luckily, they do have two inhibitors. Sans able to clear the ways, throw them in Lina Blitz. No, 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 gonna be the Nagan of Kupalan Tagalog. I slam Tagalog, the Filipino, and I'm not going to make a scot off. But then, Super Marco, the Bugu, but I'm AP Bren, him. Nagat him, Silapumas, and Onik. He's by us. There it is, Ogwin. Every time does it. Kyrie forced to go back onto the table. Ogwin, but I. Ogwin, a little bit of trouble, though, taking out the boots. We get on the matras. People at bay keep AP Bren away. They still are relentless. Super Marco, BMI's away, able to dodge Kyrie. AP Brett it's still looking for a possible shit. play here. Few ready for the set, ready for the team. Sons throwing out the Molina. Kyle Teasy maybe finally mm. decided to back off with the rest of the team. Onik lives to see another Lord. Oh, okay, para Tagalog. Gusto mo ako na mag-guest eh. Ano? <laughs> what, do, what do they have to do here? Ayan, no, legit. Ito yung, yung page, oh. Para right? makita niya. Wait lang, ha? I, I think it's pa, gonna pa, come pa, down to... Kukulit niya, kukulit niya mga mama niya. You can see that they have the damage, but it's still a little rough. Maybe if they're able to get a kill on the Kyle Teasy. Napin niyo dyan. Gusto niyo ng Tagalog. Dead joke lang, boss, Jake. Oh love you, love you. Mahal na mahal ko kayong lahat, okay? Love na love ko kayong lahat. Lahat nang nanonood dyan. Okay, natututo ko kay Pew. Ma 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 natututo ko kay Pew. Second item, Winter Truncheon. My, the fuck? Winter Truncheon, second game. Ah, second item, bre. Tapos Lightning Truncheon. Deficit. Um, uh, no, blood wings tapos ice cream one okay. Okay, okay 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 may natututunan tayo guys ha ang, ang babad na nyan baka may gusto pa kayo makita <laughs> so parang gunat ng kalaban eh tinan mo si Sans na, na force na siya mag ano genius one tsaka di, ano, divine glade maximum magical penetration he was down 3 but was able to pick up that Athena shield and I think that could attribute to that Pew is just doing so much damage in CC that he's not able to survive yeah gusto nyo ako mag cast kapag nag ano na yun nag cast nag ano na yun nag nag tawag dito nag clash na yun ano ako mag magkakas kapag nag class ano chiru chan loser chi ano chiri kri su chan kri su chan okay ang hirap ng pangalan mo next lord gonna be coming up time the clock is running onik made it up to 54k gold still about Okay, Kyrie. Si Kyrie dito ay naghahanap ng tatalo na. Pero tumama siya dun sa may bato. At dahil na pag na-return yung guard ngayon. At kung hindi ikay yung buhay ng Lord. Papasok si Kiboy. Gagamitin yung I'm offended pero walang tinamaan. That's one utility down. Flap teasing few also don't have Tama na yun, mga naman eh. Hey boy. Puray ko, bes. Ganda ng zone, putya. Wala, layo na ni Kyrie. Hindi makakatalon. Kakatalon lang, pre. Pwede na, trasa na, pre. Ogwin. Hmm. Still nobody goes down with Super Marco with the Blazing Duet. Kyrie misses. He's under fire. But he's okay. Onik still backing off. Flap Teasy able to keep them in the base. Stay in your spot. Don't worry. AP friends coming soon. 
That was a lot of utility baited out right there by the side of Onik. I I mean, they could you, 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 Walang pang win there, walang pang win there, pero tapos. Nice one, nice one, nice one guys. Nice one guys, ganun lang. Ganun lang, ganun lang, ganun lang, ganun lang. Nice one, nice one guys, nice one. I mean, you gotta... AP being able to reach a match point, but Onik just put up such a great fight, it was just... I mean, it was anybody's game into the early match, and we'll kind of probably jump into some of the highlights to see some of the turning points that definitely caused Onyx to fall back a little bit. To be fair, the whole tournament of the Onyx Esports is so beautiful, but it's here in the Grand Finals. It means that Onyx is doing everything they can. I feel like Onyx is playing the best. For me, because you know, it's like an aura. If everyone is good, everyone is good. Aurahan to eh. Kapag naunahan kang maaurahan ng kalaban mo. For example, si Flap. Flap versus Boots. Diba? Nauna siyang aurahan eh. Kapag naaurahan ka ng mauna kang maaurahan, malulugi ka. Ganun siya. May ano siya eh. May tama siya sa... May ano siya. Tawag dito, may tama siya internally. Psychologically, kan? Kita masih pelak preu. Yeah, I mean, they just really couldn't find. Kita langsung membuhus dan lahat dan skill. Nang ni boots, para lang mapa tayo. Like you were saying earlier, even though boots goes into the backline and dies. Malu walik pasal sikit nang aro, mama ya lam nades. Tapi kal malah tayo guys, kal malang, chill, easy. Tidak pat aposan lawan pre, tidak pat apos. Kita ada nampin onik yan, okay onik yan, onik is for si pre. So could have been a little bit of a rough play for him. Di pa to tapos. Di pa tapos ang laban, okay? With Super Marco, and again, there's Boots diving into the back line, trying to make progress. And the Molina Blitz able to burst down Kyle Tizi, but again, AP Brin still not being. Napakatalas ni Ogin talaga no. Nang galing yung maglaro, galing yung magarlot. Sobrang hirap ipull off ng Arlot Roma, legit. And isa sila sa mga talaga. Isa sila, hindi pala isa sa mga team. Sila lang ang team na nakakapag-pull off ng Arlot Rome. Okay, may gumagamit eh. Nung nakaraan kalaban na Twisted Minds ata. Gumamit sila ng Arlot Rome. Pero hindi nila super na napagana. Onik able to defend, able to do well. Tanong mo sa iyo ba tama ba na Onik? O hindi naman Jules Gaming TV, grabi ka naman. Hindi lakas, lakas ang team niya. Na aurahan lang sila ng AP Brent. Early pa lang na aurahan na sila. Feeling ko kailangan nilang alisin dito. Vexana. Feeling ko. Kailangan nilang alisin yung Vexana. Boss mo ka mag-spam Jules Gaming na basa ko naman. Pansin mo boss, di magawang maging aggressive ni Giboy kapag AP Brun ka katapat. Ewan ko eh, may something sila eh. May daming error ni Bruce ko. Hindi naman. Sinisisin nyo si Bruce ko. Wala naman siya dito. Grabe naman ngayon. He got the the trio in, then goes for the Malik Roar on top of it. Grabe, guys. Guys, kalma ha. Game 2. Game 2. Nakuha natin game 2, pero hindi pa tapos ang laban. Hindi pa tapos. Best of 5 to. Any moment, pwedeng bumalik ang Onyx. Napanood na natin to. Nung M5 World Championship, 3-1 yung score. Nakabawi, nag-3-3. Okay, di pa tapos to. Mamaya na tayo magdiwang. Pero pwede kayo magdiwang, pero wag sobra. Kalma lang. Kalma, chill. Chill. Sasabihin na naman ng Indo mamaya na i-strike. May sakit kasi Onyx, Lods. Wala ata si... Wala ata sa focus. Hindi ko sure Mitch and Diego. Pero baka. Baka. 
They just didn't have that frontal line. Ang Emel kasi, lalo na pag nasa international ka, hindi lang siya mental toughness. Dapat physically and emotionally rin. So, emotionally ready ka rin sa lahat ng mga mga kasalubong niyo. For example, yan, weather. Panahon. Hindi mo siya kontrolado eh, sa totoo lang eh. Di ba? Yung about sa game, about sa stat, sa, ano, sa technicalities, yun yung mga bagay na makukontrol mo eh. Pero yung sakit, hindi mo siya makukontrol eh. Ganun talaga eh. Red Slayer Channel, Boss Burito, wala talaga palag. Shout out na lang sa name, Renard Q. <laughs> Shout out si Renard. Hello po, hello po. Richard Mark Rabano, baba lang ng konti amas, mamaya na sobrahan. Tama. Okay, nakita niyo yung match-up. Gilang, Gilang San. Si Gilak San. Ang ganda ng laro. Wait lang. Ang init ako eh. Kukuha ang pagkain sa glit. Diyan lang kayo ha. Wait lang. Wait lang. Well, after that, we're gonna let the teams rest up for just a second. We're gonna grab a cup of water, grab some popcorn, take a break, use the bathroom. We're gonna be right back to the possible match point for AP Brent. In a world that seeks a balance between metaverses and healthy lifestyle, video games and traditional sports, live shows and web entertainment, we found the only way to harmony. Introducing a new era in the realm of sports, Fidgetal, a revolutionary fusion of the physical and digital worlds. This is an unparalleled mix of the most exhilarating and dynamic youth sports disciplines, all integrated with popular video games and cutting-edge technological devices. This unique sports format is accessible to all. Anyone can participate in Fidgetal competitions. Any sport has the potential to evolve into a Fidgetal experience. Football, basketball, hockey, racing, martial arts, shooters, and many other sports have successfully adapted to the new reality. The 2024 Games of the Future okay. is a global multi-sport okay. event that represents dahil the pinnacle of ako. digital sports at worldwide. Dahil naka break sila, naka-commercial break. Bringing together 2,000 participants from over 100 countries. Tayo kakain muna. Oh, shoutout muna tayo. Sina ba is weaving? Shoutout sa'yo two, two items daw na. Daw eh, di naman binubo yung curse helmet. Oh, hindi naman talaga binubo yung curse helmet. Depende, depende. Kasi ang habol mo lang naman dun is yung sa molten air. Essence, eh, yung aura ng Molten Essence. Depende, depende. Di sana yung mga caster. Hindi, marunong yan. Malulubid yan, mga yan. Iba-iba e, kasi... Hindi ko alam eh. May sakit daw, minitin ngayon yung Onyx. Nakapunta na nga ng Grand Finals, sakit pa. Sabi ni Ronaldo. Magandang, ano, magandang argument yan. Uh, again, babalik tayo dun sa aurahan. Ha. May, totoo yung aurahan, hindi lang... Hindi lang siya parang, right, G, we ano. are back. It's match point for a grand finals. Grand finals. <laughs> grand finals. Whole lot of money on the line. Whole oh, lot of pride, man. ego, and everything on the line right here. Ah, kain muna tayo, and guys. Brent is trying to make quick work. Sorry, ha. They're trying to Na, get out nakalagay sa malaking, to back home ano ba tawag dito, tasa. Onyx trying to Alakay lay the process to, actually, here. Mo. At this point, the only way out for Onyx is a yeah, no. clean reverse nakalagay sweep. They gotta win adobo. three games <laughs> in a row. And it doesn't feel very At good in their favor. Kakain tayo ng kanin, okay? Habang wala. Ano yun, wala yata si Coach Shea pagkakala mo ng anak ko. Ang alam ko ng anak kayo, boy. Umuhi siya sa vacation. Hindi ko alam kung kasama siya. Hindi ko rin nakita. Sorry. Totoo ka natin mamaya. Diba kasi nakatulong sila? Totoo ka natin mamaya. Diba kasi nakatulong sila? The golden road. Like, Onik was looking for the uh, the grand slam. They were looking for MPL season. They were looking for MSC, and they were looking for Worlds. Whereas when we looked at Onik, they had taken ISF, they had taken C Games, and then they took Worlds. And now they're over in Russia, trying to take another one. Just become, just really cementing their legacy overall. They got rent paid at their boot camp. Grabe aura ni Plop no ng mama masalin. Na aurahan nga bre. Ano? Mitch San Diego o na aurahan nga. Boss Jay, ano boss kailan magsimula MPLS 13? 
sa what ano po sa March 15 kita kasi on a whole other level right now kita kasi sa March 15 alam ko na bibenta na ng ticket or pabenta na ng ticket check niyo lang yung MPLPH na Facebook page if we if we see it they're gonna have to sure, isang lapag lang yan ano na naman to break that tempo right uh, like they're gonna have sold to come up with some type of strategic natin. comp to break it but at this point like AP is just singing a tune a whole different tune and Onyx just can't get on that frequency it's a hard time for and just go shape nakita mo ay yan pala eh nasa na dyan pala eh I lost I'm losing to you for a second <laughs> naglalag <laughs> siya ay <laughs> I love your facial it's, expression. It's the so digital lagging. taking over me. It's the digital. It's the digital. He's turning into a game of future. Um, <laughs> I need my physical back. There we go. Okay, na, okay, na, ulay, okay, na, ulay, siya. We're back. 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 We're every avenue that onic has and baka ako si Viana shout out to you right? hello like they they've done they've Berador been trying to do like shout out a little bit of the, shout out to my wife Annalisa Yeyeh yeah yan anak ko from Riyadh so shout out po shout out po kay Annalisa Yeyeh of course like a more uh, a slow yeah yan try to control sabi ni Idol Zena watching from Antigua pa shout out Jerome or or Kahada shout out to you Jerome or Kahada hello become like monster brain or something i don't know they just they, mm. they you can't stop them once they're on their that stride adobo boy right now sir boris ah oh, adobo they're just continuously yung, getting the yung better adobo of, na yung toyo man like yung toyo we're, adobo. We're, we're wondering oh man they're giving up to guinevere Sorry. and they were ready for it at this point i don't feel like it matters what onic picks um they just have to not let Turn that switch guys. get hit, man. And when this or when the switch does get hit, they can't let it hurt them. And all start. I mean, when the switch happened, was AP Bren got like a full team wipeout, and Onik had the lead in the laning phase. They they were feeling yeah. really good about themselves, but then it happened, right? The like you'd like to say, mm -hmm. the the switch was flipped. AP Bren gets a full team wipeout, and from there on, <laughs> AP Bren was everywhere. Once they find that Nagutom moment, they're all over Sorry. them. May Not kasamang ASMR to. <laughs> Idol kita sa pagiging kasar. Thank you so much, one. baka ako si Viana. So, Maraming salamat Onik, po uh, to, sa I'm appreciation. Like maybe last battle and efforts, just take things really slow. Gagalingan ko pa. <laughs> don't, even, don't even try to force fights in the beginning. Um, I don't know, they gotta figure something out here because this, these could be the end this could be the end of the grand finals for them yeah match point i mean what the only thing i can nope. possibly nope. think of is that onyx just needs to stop making those micro mistakes but done business are, question on the moment, moment sorry they do that's how si the team is going to occur right? they, they tend to try to break you and split AP but they also split their cells in the last to, game tanda tanda to, tanda tanda to, tanda tanda which caused a little bit of a downward spiral for onyx at that point sabi ni Julius Almario so, basta pa shout out asawa mahilig kumain ng seaweed kasama mainit na kanin hindi ako makain ng seaweed pero like you said take it Si, ano, si Marian, Chloe. Hello, Marian, Chloe. Chloe. Si ano si Marian Chloe. Hello sa yung Marian Chloe from Julius Almayo. Sabi ni Trip Mo TV, hi sir, pwede pa shout out kay James Valdiviso, my friend who loves to play ML. Thanks po. Shout out sa yo. Pechi Pechi, shout out kay Bonito. Bonito, isa shout out kay Bonito, isa shout out kay Bonito. I understand where he's coming from. He's looking. He's looking for the trade, Arslan, right? zero eight. Shout out to you. Shout out to Asawa Ko, Nasi Eliza Santiago. Hello, pa. Kala ko di pa pansin niya sabi na ayo. But no man, bro. But no man, madam. Hindi pa pansin ko kayo lahat. Jackson, hello. Shout out. Ah, po kay Yuji at Yuen from Abu Dhabi. Hello, Abu Dhabi, UAE. Shout out po. Sa lahat ng mga friends natin. At sa lahat ng mga KML natin yan sa UAE. Shout out po sa inyo. Yeah, I mean. Boots definitely was that. Kailan tayo? Kailan tayo, guys? Pizza boot, as a beer while watching burrito. Something to try to just make a play. And I think maybe that could have caused you know a little bit of a a disruption on on it. Kailan tayo, guys? They done lost their exp lane and again. Ito po ba ang nyo na YouTube account? Yap, yap, pa pa pa. Uh, they with with the Kaka start lang nitong YouTube account na to. Actually, hindi, hindi pala kakasal. 
on a quite open. Matagal na siya. So, I felt like Pero, it was good, but maybe not ko lang siyang as well calculated as I'd like to see. Ko lang siyang gamitin. So, uh, Pero matagal na siya. Coming into the next series, maybe, so, last, last maybe not pa. being so aggressive, maybe diving so, into the front line instead of back line. 2019, 2020. That way you have your team behind you. Pero ngayon ko lang siya ginamit. <laughs> I feel like those Parang are starting January. So, papansinin mo lahat ng mga contents ko. Again, the slow ko lang noong January. Start ako noong January, February. Like so, sabihin na natin na two months na ako nag-YouTube. Like Pero, hindi full-time like ha. YouTube lang na ano. Kunyari, may madaanan lang ako uh, na pwedeng... Pwedeng ano, pwedeng oh, video hand. Like like video ang ko gano'n. O kaya, naisip ang content. Gagawa ko content. A little bit. Sorry, we still love you, G. You still look great, I promise. APBRNG, shout out sa'yo. Hello. Um, so 2-0. I want to take a look at some, of the picks. Si some time. I can get him to load up real quick. With the way things have gone. Mm -hmm. We've seen we've seen the Nolan get let up. My guess is most likely AP Bren will be on blue side this time. Maybe I'm wrong. If it if it was decided that the loser get to pick their their side, then maybe Onik will take blue side again. Um like, share, and sub na. Oh, tama. Talamans ka. Ano, SMD. I-follow nyo na. I-sub nyo na to. Mag-subscribe na kayo dito. Tama yan. Tsaka lahat ng social media ko. Facebook. TikTok. Diyan ako lagi. They're just able to, uh, they're able to, to stop and engage page. with the CC. Simple they shot. get terrified, they get knocked up, whatever, whatever it is. Shout out to Doki Ragnar, shout out to Willy. That's what I'm face waving. <laughs> and I'm wondering, like, is there a possible thought? Abaka niya, may mga surprise sa kami ni Laman Jin. Abaka niya na, may mga niluluto kami na talaga magugustahan niya, okay? Chill lang kayo dyan. Shout out to Boss Burish from General Santa City. Hello, Raymond Burdo. Is that something that maybe... At the British Glancer na din ba ang AP brand pag nanalo si um, na sila dyan? Uh, oh, siguro. Oh. For me kasi ang Grand Slam, tatlong sunod-sunod. Pero kung tatlong sunod-sunod na major tournaments nakuha mo ang championship, feeling ko makukonsider siya as Grand Slam. For me, ah, for me lang. If it was the best of seven, you could maybe risk one Guys, more game, right? Guys, solid nito ni Idol Magkas. Oy, salamat but, uh, naman, Viana. Kind of Not kayo ka, MPLPA Season 13. So, Mag-start na po siya sa March 15, now, okay? Pero bago yun, MDL Season 3. Okay? Kasi after nun Season 3, may surprise ang MDL para sa lahat ng mga amateur players sa buong mundo. Okay. I-announce na naman nila yan. Ayoko mo nang ilagay dito. Yeah. I mean, Ayaw mo nang i I feel like Vexana dito. is definitely one of those mage, like, they're, she's Let just, she cook. has terrified, <laughs> she has CCs, the undead knight that she drops. Boss, pasensya na, ako makain like ako, ha. It's like an additional person on the playing field, so I do think that it would probably be a good uh, a good option to definitely throw it in the sabaw, phase, pre, oh. yun yung masarap, again, eh. I think yung... it just comes down to what you were stating Wala earlier, sabaw, that, pero the overall makakapit yung sabaw. Kaska din po ba sa MDL? Hindi, hindi, hindi po. Pero kung, alam, alam ko may invite din naman ka na, MDL. Tapos mga MDL cast, MDL caster, may invite ulit sa MDL. Parang dating gawin. I've been seeing Fairness almost every time, if I'm not mistaken, so yeah, uh, again, so I, I think it's just more of that it's really hard to mm. ban out a team like AP Bren. So, I think if, if you're not coming with a plan to immediately toss and throw AP Bren around, like you're you're just ultimately going to have a hard time. From what I'm the seeing, right? um, and again, I think it just comes down to that you just have to just be better. Uh, you have to control the lanes. Get good know, kids. That's what I'm saying, right? And sometimes it could just come down to maybe coming together. Stop stop fo Ooh, focusing on the, no. the turtles, right? Like, give the turtles to AP Brent. Focus on taking towers. Because in every game we've seen, a, uh, Onik had, like, maybe one tower. In the last game, I don't think Onik had any towers taken down. So it just it, it just goes to show that you got to focus on maybe... Ch like trade things you know i feel like that's the the biggest thing that you have to look at here and i mean do you agree yeah i definitely agree i i mean i think it's 
I think there's a lot of variables, and in the end, yeah, I mean, in the end, Onik, because that's what AP Bren is doing. Like, they're just, they're, they're not too, like, yes, they're, they're Sarsa yan ba, so, Sarsa. But, um, S13 sa March 15 po, start no March 15, ang um, MPL. Sabi ni FakeMoto.ph, siniscape ko Viva Max para malun ng ML. Tama yan, bre. A lot like of eyes really on strat- this game right Pahinga mo naman yung kamay mo, bre. Like really strategizing ano right now. Like, this is do or die. Like, what do we pull out of our sleeves to just, like, you know, knock the socks off of Ako AP Bren? Like, I feel like that's the ultimate decision <laughs> Onik has to make here. Is do, do we go risky? Do we just Boss, take a textbook? What are, what are our Kung options? Inyo, Maria push yan. back against the wall. <laughs> we fought back. And it's just been a, a little tough for him. Unless, yeah. I mean, if if GD Ico was like, but M6 in Malaysia, Oh, Malaysia. Good, Malaysia. Good, yo. Know, <laughs> na yon, nung M5. Get good. Get Last day, M5 yeah. in Malaysia. Stop making mistakes. Stop making mistakes. Hey, you. Stop that, all right? Which one of us? Just you. All right? Fair, yep. fair. Very, very fair. Very fair. You know, uh, as I was saying, a lot, a lot of people are watching right now. We get a lot of eyes on this game right now. Since we have some time, you know, we got uh, all the boys back home watching. We got uh, a lot of players watching. Um, I'm, I'm excited, man. I think I, I, I think the possibility is definitely there for Onik to be able to take this game back and maybe give us another one. We've seen them do it before. You know, you were mentioning M5 earlier, and they took a loss, they took a win. They, they, they were sitting at match point against AP Bren in the World Championships, and we're able to come back ha, to, to, a game to a game seven. Nung M5, so it's definitely not out three one na yung standing non na habol nila ng three three. They have to be able to shoot. Okay. Yeah. So, kalma lang tayo. Um, ano daw? They have to be able to... Because right now, AP Bren is feeling themselves, man. Kelra or Arbert? They, they're a team that... Um, you can see Kelra. them when they're on Kel- camera, man. Kelra. They're a team that they feed no doubt. that, man. When they start getting the better of you, the way they play the game, you can tell their pace may, may faster, player din po faster, ba ang Russia faster, Idol? Sabi faster. ni MC Zol. Oh, meron, meron. Point, point, they have all the inhibitors um, gone. That's when it's like... RCC. Yeah, yung RCC. And then they get back like they Umabot sila hanggang round 2 ng playoffs, quarterfinals. Yan, umabot silang quarterfinals. And it's kain ng you know, kanin ngayon para si effect, Burrito na lang daw ang ulam. We're going to coin that. <laughs> so you're going to coin it. Ayub Kanimrod shoutout sa iyo. The Bren effect. We need the Trex effect. Where is that at? The Trex effect is here. Waiting, oh, okay. waiting for the next all game, right. waiting for the next game. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. No, and I mean I can understand it, right? Like the just. Well, it's, a, it's, a tough, it's a tough game for Onik, right? Like, uh, what what they've done in the past to kind of change some of the tides around is that I think they need, a, I think they need a more aggressive gold lane, right? Like the carry just is too frontal. I think they need maybe they can pull out the Wan Wan, you know, like pull out something that could that could possibly change the time. Ano ulam mo boss burrito? Adobo source, po. You know? um, Adobong maraming paminta. Oh, there goes G again. All good. Um, so yeah, right now still just waiting. I definitely think they need something that can change the tides of this match. G, you look <laughs> great as a microphone. The microphone actually matches your tie, G. So I just want to say that. It actually kind of looks like G. There's his little arms. <laughs> We're just going to wing this here. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> here we go. Still waiting on AP Brand up against Sonic. I'm guessing both teams are taking their time for sure. I mean, like live said, this is the Alden prize pool we've ever oh, seen. Live stream of Alden Richards, though. Big shout out to all the, yeah, to all the watch shall. parties around right now. Mirko, Naisu, I see you guys. DJY, Chicken back home. All my boys. We're having a lot of fun up here. Just waiting on GDI Co to reconnect real fast. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and yeah, I think at this point, like me and G have said time after time again. Pag nalagay ka sa ganyan sitwasyon bilang caster, may AP brand. May, ano siya, medyo awkward siya na position like kasi mga wala yung kasama, may. Kailangan mo mag... Kailangan mong ano? Kailangan mong balik yung sarili mo. Tinan mo siya natatawa na si Trex. Hopefully soon. I don't know. I'm just hitting some ninjutsu, man. I'm just like, you know, disappearing and reappearing, you know? Damn! Good looking's back. What's up? Good looking's back. The microphone actually matched your tie. I'm just gonna say, man. The microphone actually matched your tie. 
So it kind of looked like you. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Well, hey, at least we weren't in game. We're able to, you know, just <laughs> deal with what we have to. I'm not sure what's uh, kind of going on. I'm not sure what's going on. I'm not sure what's going on. I'm not sure what's going on. I think he was like, yeah, I'm going to go grab a glass of water. Oh, when you're going to go, you're going to go. You're going to go. Kailangan mo lang ibalik yung sarili mo. Kailangan mo lang ano. Paano ba? Nangyari na kasi sa akin minsan yan eh. Pero hindi sa malaking event. Parang amateur tournament lang. Nawala yung kasama ko. Right, so here we are at Tapos, podcast. I'm gonna ano na lang ako. Kwento-kwento na lang ako ng mga nangyari sa buhay ko. <laughs> Oo, oh, sa RG. Yan kunya rin nagay na kwento ko yung sarili ko. Sa RG. Mga ganun. Sa mga boss sa Discord ni Boss Manjin. Nandun si... Wolf at saka si Banners. Talaga, wait lang ha. Punta ako sa Discord. Manggugulo ko. Yan din ang Discord. Ah, dito si Ano Ochi. Most of the exciting moments I would say definitely happened in like the playoff area. You know, like I I was voting for Blacklist International and then Fireflux just like sweeps the rug out from underneath of them which was just, it blew my mind away. Another one was that Deuce Volts, I thought they were going to... Uy, si Toburitz. Hello, boss. Hello. Oi, Toburi. Ano game burrito naman? Ano ba? Ano ng game? Oi, Toburi, meron kaming goal dito ah. Ano? 5 minutes, 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 minutes lang ah. 5 minutes, 5 minutes. English Tagalog, English Tagalog ha. Ah, inaano niyo, nililipat-lipat niyo. Oh, may nasa Tagalog ka, sakto na, buto mo sa Tagalog. Ah, okay. Ka pa. Nililipat-lipat niyo pala. Okay. Hindi, okay. okay. salita lang namin. Oh, okay. You know, that was Okay, Snipe Gaming, okay, magpakita so, ka naman sa amin bukas. Ah, bakit loo, di ba si Snipe Gaming? Um, Sabi niya ata, pakita ka ka sa amin. Dota 2, siyempre. Dota 2! Diana Mormont or Arya Stark? Stark, Diana Mormont tayo, boss. Pero, okay kung si Arya Stark. Goods yun, goods yun. Ako, dalawa lang ang ano ko, best grill. Si Maigari Tyrell. Oh, si him. At saka si Team Sansa Stark ako eh. Oh, love you. Mga mga sinat na ako ha. Bye-bye, bye-bye. Uy, 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 uy,
me. <laughs> Maniniwala ba kayo sa pag-abang ko ni Yawi? Ang dahilan. Probably hindi naman. Zekil. Kumakaling din kasi ibang mga teams, guys. Hindi naman pwedeng. Tama, ano? tama, tama. Eh, ko lang naman malakas. Ganun yun. Oo naman, oo naman. Imagine ano yun ito. Siyempre, imagine tayo dito, mas dito, ano eh. Maganda ang bigayan dito eh. Maganda bigayan, nandito na tayo eh. Hindi, hindi pala natin status yun ah. Bahala na sila mag-decide. Paano na yung Ragnarok? Ragna, boss. Prime Coco Claude or New Era MM? Okay, timer, English. Alright. I think, ah... Prime Coco Claude was a different beast. Yeah. I agree. C or C or Plants vs. Zombies? C or C? C or C? C or C. Ah, Plants vs. Zombies. Hey, why is Burrito not talking anymore? Hey, Burrito. It's English time. It's English time. I'm eating. I know it's English time. Okay, what are you eating? What are you eating, Burrito? Adobo. Okay. Adobo! It's Adobo! 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 It's Adobo! Avatar Animated Or Netflix Avatar Animated Zeus Huh? What? Army Navy or Burrito? Why Orb? That's the same I will choose Burrito Bobby Tricks Carry or Bobby Tricks Rod? I will ask Burrito here Burrito! It's up to you! You choose! It's up to you Burrito! You're the answer! Um... Next question please Next question please I was hey I I watched your uh, your BY's clip Wolf. You asked about the ten greatest players and why said you can also put Bobby Tricks in the ten greatest players. <laughs> yeah, of course. My God, <laughs> my God. Favorite flavor of Pancit Canton. My favorite <laughs> flavor is chili uh, No, you you buy two Pancit Canton, right? The, the other okay. one is mm. calamansi. The other one is extra spicy. Mm. You and you mix. You mix. you mix them. Very extra good. Extra spicy chili manji. Yes, sir. I have a What's question. That? I have a question for Burrito also. What? If you're gonna cook the pancit canton, mm. what comes first? Do you mix the sauce first and then you add the noodles? Or you, you put the noodles first and then do you mix the sauce? What comes first? I put na dun the noodles first. Noodles first, and then you put the the sauce. That's the traditional way of cooking. For me, I mix I mix the sauce first like this. I mix it like this. Yeah. And then I add the noodles. I I also do that because I like watching cement being mixed when I was young. So I do that. I mix the cement. Prime Chaknu or Ogwen? Wow, good mm. question. We got. That's a good question. I think uh, I have a. I think Ogwen might be. I think Ogwen you know, can, we haven't can seen be a that, right? but I think um, I think Ogwen. Honestly, yeah. honestly. Prime Echo or Prime Black? No, that's difficult. Very, very difficult. Oh, that's. It, it, Jimmy Butters or Jimmy Santos? <laughs> we are waiting for PH versus ID again. Maybe, maybe in Riyadh. Who knows? Who knows what's gonna happen? Shoutouts, by the way, to the Bacolod peeps here, to the Ilongos here. They are asking why Ocho Gahaba. In my in my hometown. Ocho Gahaba means born to penetrate. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm I'm like that. I want to break we the know. limits. I, think we the limit. I thought you want to penetrate. No, no. No. The, uh, the of Ocho Gahaba in my hometown. I'm talking mm. about my hometown. We have our local language there. Our local dialect. And in our local dialect, Ocho Gahaba means born to break limits. All right? The the limit breaker. The limit breaker. <laughs> the limit breaker. So you're the limit breaker. So it's the I, limit yeah, breaker wait. podcast. Yeah. Okay. No. I'm, no. Not, I'm. I'm not in a hotel, Mr. Snipe. I'm. I'm in the house of my friend. Really? Is that yes. the OSS house? No. Wait, lang guys. Ah, sorry. Ah, <laughs> no overwhelm. Ako yan. Dami nang yari. 
<coughs> Ayan. Sorry, pwede man tanong sino mas bata ay prim bata o si Megan yan. Wait lang ha, no-overwhelm ako yun. <laughs> Kaya abang inaantay natin. Shoutout sa inyo, shoutout kay Jassy. Hello Nimrod, hello Ivan. Red alert or generous? Red alert tayo dyan pre. Yung Hannes Rob kakamba ni Inspi. Oo, oh, pare. Halos pareha sila, tapos pareha sila halos ng tono. <laughs> Watching from Beringan, sabi ni Edwin Aquila. <laughs> Shout out sa'yo. Wala, ano pala yan? Pahinga pa yan. Baka may mga... May mga technical issues pa na inaayos doon. <coughs> Si Hansrob TV kinontent si ESP Gaming. Legit ba? Legit. Malaki ba? Na? Malaki ba nuko? Hindi naman ah. Malaki ba? Hindi naman. Parang pantay lang. Actually kaya ako nag, nag-headband dahil nga sa... May, may fan ako dito sa taas eh. So... Ah. Ah. Shoutout sa'yo, uh, Axeman. Hello. Mr. Craft. Hello sa'yo. Game 5 po ba yan? Yeah, best of 5 pero <clears throat> pero 2-0 pa lang. Okay. Talo na po ba Blacklist? Yup, yup, yup. Talo na. Grand Finals na total eh. <clears throat> Bakit ka pumasok? Ano? Mas malaki kayo man din. Aray, yung, yung ano ko? Ay, yung noo. <laughs> <clears throat> Shinbo o Butters sa pagwapuhan Uh, sure. <laughs> sa pagwapuhan batters Alright, here we are back once again. <laughs> De, joke lang, joke lang. Mahirap, mahirap tumimbang ng ganyan, pre. Yeah, Then hindi malaki boss burrito, malapad lang. Malapad pa. Actually, hindi, parang ayun no, tatlo lang. Uh, tatlo ng daliri, pre. Let's get let's simulan ng MPL sa March 15. March 15 post start ng MPL. Hello po. It was it was definitely it was definitely a vibe. It was definitely a vibe. Um Oh, yeah. Pag si ba ng lamok dugo mo, magiging kadugo mo sila, sabi ni Gary Official. Piling ko, kasi mapupunta sa katawan nila yung dugo mo, so magiging magkadugo na kayo. Hindi, mapupunta lang sa kanya yung dugo. Ewan ko kung anong ibig sabihin ng kadugo sa inyo. Ano po kulang ng blacklist sa tingin nyo po, sabi ni Viana. Wala namang... Mahirap, mahirap i-ano, i-pinpoint para sa perspective ng isang casual player na katulad ko, yung kulang ng blacklist doon sa, sa naging run nila. Siguro more, more chemistry pa para sa trio mid nila. Y- yun lang siguro yung pinaka, maano, masasabi ko. Kasi kailangan pa nilang mag- magkaroon ng sobrang tagal na panahon na paglalaro, ganun. At saka yung chemistry, kailangan nilang aralan pa. Chantel Omara Aquino. <laughs> magkaiba kasi ng, ano eh, magkaiba kasi ng linya yan eh. Si Mara Aquino is more hosting, si Chantel is shoutcasting. So, parang sila magaling sa craft na ginagawa. Ano pong masasabi nyo na bumaba si Chak mo sa MDL? Hindi naman bumaba. Nalipat siya sa MDL. Pero that doesn't mean na bumaba siya. Yan. Albert to CW? Uh, based sa naging performance si CW at Albert kasi si Albert ang pagbabasihan ko lang is yung anong game, ngayong tournament eh si CW yung mga nakaraang games pa nung M5 yun CW ako sa MDL ba lalaro si Chakno sa Vigilus? oo kasi MDL Tan- sige nga maglapag nga kayo ng mga tanong dito para masagot naman natin yung mga gusto nyo tanong pre. top 4 MPL teams this upcoming MPL PH top 1 ko ay AP Bren top 2 ko ay Uh, RSG right Top 3 ko ay Blacklist Top 4 ko ay Ay Echo Ay hindi, top 3 ko ang Echo Top 4 ko ang Blacklist Boss, ano headset mo? Ito, a flex stone Na parang shark Shark something yung Ano Ganda, ganda 
Magkita po ba kita sa MPL? Oo naman, nice, oo naman. Nice Pero wala pa kaming schedule eh. We'll so, we'll i-ano we'll naman, we'll sabihan so. i- uh, I-announce ko na lang sa Facebook page ko yung schedule natin. The, uh, Mama mo, Papa mo. Mama ko. <laughs> uh, best man Jean tandem sa casting, Chantel o Shinbu. Best man Jean tandem sa casting, Chantel o Shinbu. Magkaiba ng, ano, magkaiba ng play style si Shinbu at si Chantel. Shinbu and Manjin, sila yung literal na switching pag magka, magkasama sila. Si Chantel at si Manjin, tito-tita uh, na, na vibe. So, parehas silang magaling doon sa specific na parang niche na meron sila. Sino mas guwapo Milo Ragnar? Hindi ko alam, Noel. <laughs> Sabi ni Raven Vlogs, ano sa palagay mo? Reason bakit tumalis si Yawi sa Echo? May, for sure may internal problem yan. Pero, hindi naman to the point na aalis siya. I mean, kasi kung talagang mabigat yung naging reason, hindi naman pupunta sa sister company itong si Yawi. Diba? Baka lumipat yan sa iba, iba, iba pang mga teams, ba diba? So, kung the fact na pumunta si Yawi sa Aura, which is sister company ng Echo, feeling ko may... Maybe ban out the Vexana instead or ano, you know, something na like that. Nila yon, paglipat niya. Bobby or Tricks. <laughs> Bobby tayo dyan, pre. Nimrod, shoutout sa'yo. May nababalita ka ba ngayon na MPLPH nang babalagbag sa screams ngayong M- pre-MPL S13, boss? Wala eh. Hindi pa ako nakikiramdam eh. Pero based sa based sa lineup, based sa nilabas na roster, feeling ko kailangan nila maging sa RSG. Kasi Demon Kite, Kosei, Aqua. Parang sila na yun eh. Sila solid yun eh. Nawala si Eman, oo, pero nandiyan naman si uh, ano, si Kosei. Uh, Lods, ano yung mic mo? Uh, ano to? Fantech Leviosa. Mura lang to actually. Pero sobrang ganda nito. Para sa mga startup na ano, para sa mga walang budget na mag gusto mag-stream, sa mga walang budget na gusto mag-start ng shoutcasting, kailangan mo ng setup. Eh. So, ito yung binili ko para makapag-start ako mag-shoutcast. Kahit hindi ganun kalaki yung budget ko. Parang less than 2K ata to or nasa 2K lang. Then, sobrang mura. Boss, sino ba talaga si Gildark? Hindi ko alam fake mo to PH eh. Kim Martin, So, uh, we'll see exactly how it goes. Boost the mante. When start ng MPL sa so March 15 po. Um, Mitch and Diego, adobo, kare-kare, adobo. Nagagutting sa tingin mo, boss. Ano tatalo sa AP brand lineup? Uh, uh, the season 13, abangan nyo yung RSG. Promise, RSG. Kailangan paghanda ng AP brand yan. Julius or Mario, ano masasabi yung boss bulit sa laruan ni Yawi sa Aura? Ngayon, halos nagagawa na ulit yung galawan niya sa na Echo Express. Actually, kung iisipin mo ay yung Echo Express dahil yun sa explosive na playstyle ni Yawi kasama yung San San Duo. So, doon na buo yung Echo Express. Diba? Doon do, do, natawag yung Echo Express. Eh. Kasi ba diba, Echo Express para siyang para siyang trend. Para siyang trend. Ganun. You know what? It's okay. We find out in the draft the moment the G leaves. I'm okay with that. Here we are. Game, game, game. Either Lili Malakas, M2 Bren or M5 Bren. M5 Bren. M5 Bren. Kung magkaiba silang meta yun eh, pero for me ah, M5 Bren. Sobrang dominating. Shoutout po, Myla, Geraldine, Babak. Hello po, shoutout sa iyo. Hello then, uh, Brian, Bobby o Trix, Bobby, Irobi Moto, Dugaya, oy, anong Dugaya? Otep, dito nga muna ako, ang ingin nila manjin. Oh, ang ingin nila manjin, grabe. Na-overwhelm nga ako, kaya nga nag-ano ako, nag-defend ako. <laughs> Sabi ni Nansin, agil kayo kay Mirko, yung blacklist daw, parang ordinary team na lang daw. Ma- maanghang yung yung statement. Pero, feeling ko, again, babalikan ko yung statement ko na kailangan i-work out yung k- kailangan i-work out yung I mean, kailangan pa nila ng mas mahabang panahon para nag maglaro. Kasi yung chemistry, hindi naman siya nabubuo sa 
Siguro 2 weeks, 3 weeks na preparation. Hindi na bubuo kayo mistry dun. Kailangan araw-araw ay naglalaro. Kailangan marami na kayo mga tournaments na na, na, na daanan. And sobrang vital ng position 4 and position 5 ngayon. So, kailangan nilang mas mag-invest ng oras para sa chemistry nung trio med nila. Uh, Ivan Innocentia, best player by position in your opinion po. Magandang tanong yan ha. Uh, um, jungler. Sa panahon ngayon, it's either Kyrie or Kyle TZ. Sa mid lane, mid lane wala eh pa siguro base sa position sa ngayong ngayong panahon na sabihin ko na lang AP Bren yun na yun pero may dalawa akong ano dyan sa mid lane Sans at saka si Few Bren sa jungler, Kyrie at si Kyle, TZ. Pero dun sa, mga, sa the rest, Ogun Rome, uh, Flap TZ XP, Super Marco Gold, sila na yung pinakamalalakas sa, sa position nila ngayong panahon na to. Kaya ba mag-adjust na HS sa barangay? Na, Nakapag-adjust na. Nakikwento sa akin ni Coach uh, Aggressive kasi diba siya ay coach ng Smart Omega Neos na Nagsimula, nagsimula na magbatak at saka mukhang maganda rin ang tabas ngayon ng barangay. Dat pala nag-RG muna. O oh, nga, ano eh. Athena Shield or Radiant Armor. Athena Shield, na-nerf ang Radiant Armor, boss. Yawi Sanji, Yawi Yashike, Yawi Sanji. Tulog uh, tayo isang shoutcaster. Hindi, nagkaroon ng technical issue. Baka sa internet. Top 2 team, uh, ang blacklist sa MPLPA show. Lol. Lol. Why hate on them? O nga eh. Hindi ko, hindi ko alam. Hindi ko rin mag Pero abangan natin ha. Kasi, tandaan nyo, nag-roam nag ng matagal na panahon si Haji sa blacklist. So, kabisado niya pa rin yung roaming. Kailangan lang ng chemistry. Yun lang yun. Eh, pag naglaro naman sila sa mga screams, magagawa na nila yun eh. Bigyan lang natin ng time ang blacklist. Okay. Advantage ng Onyx, ang break, nag-restart momentum ng Bren. Pero part kasi siya ng ano yun. Siguro nasa, nasa ano yun. Nasa program flow yun na after games 1 and 2, may break. Ganun. <laughs> Bumalik na si GD Aiko. Best XP lane mo lords, local tsaka international. Sa local, flap TZ sa international. Wow. Alright. AP Bryn picked up the, the, the fair miss this time around. Yeah. Huh? yeah right. International boots. Wala na iba Itong dalawa naglalaro na to, best, best of the best na to. <laughs> ano ah, on their respective uh, roles ha. Yan na yun. Nakon passive ng lineup ng Onyx. Passive ba? Hindi, aggressive nga yung Lilia. Aggressive yung Lilia pa rin. Pati ano, red rin. It's almost like AP Bren knew man. How much po ba ang price po sa GOF? One million dollars. So, 55 million pesos. Fifty-five million pesos. Fifty-five million pesos, ha? Bigat. Bigat nun. Sabi ni Ivan, di naman kasi ganun nadali mag-build ng chemistry. Totoo yan. Sobrang hirap. Sobrang bigat. This is a respect. Hindi ganun kadali. May chance ba maging coach? May chance ba maging coach ng MPL ang isang ordinary na nag-RG lang na player? And how? Sabi ni Rayban. Um, siguro ang pinakasagot dyan, meron tayong proseso. Parang ka nag-a-apply ng trabaho. Imagine mo na lang nag-a-apply ka ng trabaho. Kailangan mo ng credentials. Diba? Kunyari, ano ka, wala kang experience mag-coach. Okay, paano? Wala kang experience mag-coach. Yeah. O oh, hindi, sabihin na lang natin, oh, okay, gusto mong mag-apply as cashier sa isang trabaho. Pero wala kang experience. Wala kang idea kung ano yung gagawin mo. Sa mga normal na trabaho, matuturo siya. Pero, kapag coach ka kasi, dapat alam mo yung, alam mo kung paano maghahawak ng tao. At paano pagagalawin yung mga tao. Kasi hindi naman biro yung mga player mo eh. 
'di ba? Pag nararamdaman ng mga players mo na mas magaling sila sa iyo, hindi ka na nilerespeto. Kanya, mas mas matalino ako dito, eh. mas magaling ako mag-draft dito, eh. but kusa sa So, pero lahat may chance. Kaya lang ang, ang hirap na. Kasi may may amateur scene, may pro, may pro scene, 'di ba? Majority ng mga pumapasok sa pro scene ay galing sa amateur scene. Kanya, yung mga ano, mga nag uh, RJ RJ yung mga naglalaro sa ano. Whatever they want, oh, man. Nag, Whatever they want. Naglalaro sa mga barabarangay. <laughs> yun, doon naman nagsimula no, lahat. I mean, eh. the claw, the, the carry, Sana ibalik niya Ako gusto ko rin assassin oh, meta. Price pool, $1 million. Dollars, ibig sabihin yan. Kung tournament mid, hati, mid, hindi lang si Chapin. Oh. Sa so champion, $350,000. Mga $19 million. $19 million pesos, pre. Para sa champion. Bigot. <laughs> okay. So, analyze na natin yung lineup. Okay. So, Stain. Uh, same formula ang AP Brand, di ba? Basta, ito lang tingnan nyo. Ha? Ito lang tingnan nyo sa lineup ng AP Brand. Kapag si Flap TZ ay naglabas ng hero na may damage, for sure ay magsusustain hero si Kain. Yun yun. And maganda nga na nag... Kasi kapag nagbarat siya dito, bababaran niya yung glooms eh. Nung Lilia. So maganda na nagbarat, ay nagback siya siya. Para makakaska po siya. Makakataka siya. Kelra on Onik, ano masasabi niyo? Excited nga ako sa Kelra on Onik. Excited ako. Ang pinaka nag-worry lang ako sa, kan- sa roster nila. Malakas ang roster nila eh. King Kong, Ke- Kelra. Ang pinaka nag-worry lang ako para sa side kay, kay Jem. Yan kasi sobrang palo din lahat ng mga XP laner. So, kailangan niya mag-step up. Si Jem kasi ang XP nila ngayon. Lakasan na natin. Game, game, game. Game, let's go. Joel saw the sounds. Oh, ito na, ito na. Lakasan ko na. Lakasan ko na. You know they got taken advantage of in game one and two. They need to not be scared to get aggressive because I think that could be huge for them here, trying to immediately shut down the pace of AP Brent. Game, let's go, let's go. True, true. And uh, I mean, it's just it is what it is, and we will find out. As uh, I think we're going to be diving into the land of dawn after we look at the crowd for one final last time, possibly. 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 <laughs> possibly. <laughs> look at the. I can't. Is the crowd like mixtures of happy? Shout out to game, 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 game. Yeah. Pretty sure those are, I'm pretty sure those are chat chat people's names, like people's <laughs> names um, above the robots. Magkano na bubunta sa player surprise? Ayan ang hindi ko sure. Ayan ang hindi ko. That guy is Pero for for season, he's still good. He's ready for the game. I'm ready for the game. All right, we're gonna jump right into a pause. This is We'll see. This is Possibly. Taking our time. Sa mga naglalive view, baka po yung mga sub nila. This arena is pretty massive. Oh, but then we need some more seats full though, man. Where's all the ball? We got Reza, Fariz. Look at that guy. Look at that legi mo ni ko nga eh. These guys, I love how oh, these guys take each other out at the same exact time. We're back. Oops, oh, back on screen, baby. We're the arena. Garo na naman ata ng problema. Wanna go, bro? Okay, tandaan nyo ha. Hindi ang problema ng caster ha. <laughs> kasi dati kapag I mean, nag- we would be battling on the mid there. kasi kapag nagkakast kami Apparently, lagi namin nakikita only, na hindi naman namin nababasa mid. during broadcast ha pero like, uh, after like broadcast a, kasi syempre nagre-review oh, kami yeah. ng mga cast ganun uh, nakikita oh, namin broad, mag- yeah. minsan yung mga comments na but, ang tagal daw mag-start yeah, puro daldal yung caster kaya nagdadaldal yung caster kasi nag-stretch ibig sabihin ng stretch Possible na nagkaroon ng problema sa loob. Possible na may pinag-uusapan. So, yun. May, may ganyan. <laughs> Mahirap yun para sa mga casters. Pinakamahabang stretch na na-experience ko sa buong casting career ko. Halos isa't kalahating oras kaming nagdadadaldal. On-site event yun sa mall. 
Imagine niyo yun sa mall. Isang oras at mahigit kami nagsasalita. Kasi nagkakaroon technical problem. Tapos tsaka lang nag-decide na okay, ikat na natin, mag-break muna tayo. Naka-broadcast yun ha. <laughs> Pero hindi sa MPL yun ha, ibang event. Essentially that's why AP Brin ended up going that route was just to farm yeah. the jungle a little bit. Kaya ano, so huwag niyo sisihin yung mga caster. Ah, di naman kami yung nagpipindot I mean, ng post. There's a lot of options. I mean, I, I, like, I, I really think Onyx... Huwag niyo kami sisihin kapag <laughs> nagpo-post o kaya nag-aaral yung break. They're not gonna be able to really pick on Basha per okay, se. Okay, mamaya maya pa yan. Baka nag-uusap-uusap pa sila doon. Tanong, baka may mga tanong pa kayo. Lapag niyo yung mga questions niyo dyan. Idol na idol kita burrito. Oh, thank you so much, Fritz, Cyril, or Beso. Idol din kita. Mag-idolan tayo, okay? Kung idol mo ako, idol kita. Idol, idol natin ng isa't isa. Ay, nakabuhay. Mid-poke. But I, to be honest, like, 3-0 na ba to AP Brent? Kayo ba guys? Sa tingin nyo ba 3-0 to? Based dun sa lineup nila. Ano yan? 7 MC ko, uh, MC Zol. Pag may technical idol, may overtime pay din ba yung asset? Wala. Wala. Um, may mga, may mga broadcast na ang bayad sa amin ay per hour. Pero sobrang konti nun. Pero ang broadcast, na may bayad sa amin ng isang buong Tsaka ano, okay din naman yung kinikita dito sa casting. Legit ha, kahit yung mga sa mall casting. Legit, maganda ang kinikita. Kasi, imagine ninyo, ang tagal ko na sa corporate, nag-resign ako ng work para i-perso itong casting. Kasi okay yung kinikita niya. Skin care reveal mo lang ako ang skin care boss. Sama pa ba sa XP listahan mo si Edward? Ano lang eh, diba ang sabi, pinakamagaling na international at pinakamagaling na local. So, pinakamagaling sa akin is Flap TZ. Pinakamagaling sa international si Boots. Pero si Edward, for sure, kasama pa siya sa top XP laners. Malapit yan to. Sana merong own skin na ibigay sa Man, manalo tulad ng M5. Dito, wala, wala, wala to. Wala to. Sabi ni Reynante, Idol, shoutout sa pinsan ko, Jarmark Gane, shoutout sa'yo, Jarmark Gane. Sabi ni Raven Vlogs, kung magiging maganda gameplay ni Boots sa Game 3, possible sa kanila yan, kahit sustain lane up ng brand. Last two games, puro maling shot call. Tingin mo ba sa burrito ko sakali, hindi ka kasay, nag-proceed ka ba, mag-flow scene? Sabi ni Julius Almario. Nangarap ako mag-pro, pero kasi may edad na ako eh. So, gusto ko lang ma-experience yung pro. Piling ko hindi ako magtatagal sa pro scene. Doon sakali mo makarating ako. Hindi rin ako magtatagal. Kasi iba na yung priority ko. Una, ang priority ko, build ng career. Tapos, uh, syempre may, 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 may family ako. So, kailangan kong kum kumayod. And hindi, hindi siya super maiintindihan ng... May papaliwanag ko ba yun sa mama ko? O kaya may papaliwanag ko ba yun? Yung mga ganun. So, para sa career, ang... Ginawa ko, start ako ng streaming, tapos after ng streaming, nakita ko na parang, uy, hindi ako mag-grow dito. Tumalun ako sa iba. Nag-try ako sa production, nag-try ako sa shoutcasting, habang nag-work ako sa corporate. Tapos yun. Nung nakita ko na, uy, parang okay na. Pwede na ako mag-resign. Kasi nag-resign ako sa work ko, sa full-time work ko. Nag-full-time akong casting. Kasi, ano naman eh. Maganda naman yung kinikita dito. As in. Siguro, bigyan ko kayo na idea. Depende sa broadcast. Depende sa... Per cast. Per day na casting. Minsan... Ibig sabihin ng per day, yung isang buong araw ng casting mo na, kunyari, dalawang oras ka lang nag-cast, yun na yun, per day na yun. <laughs> yun na yun. Uh, four digits to five digits per cast. Yun yun. Kayo na bala mag-isip kung ano, kung ano. 
kung gaano kalaki yung 5 uh, digits, know, kung gaano kalaki yung 4 uh, digits. Pero gano'n. <laughs> Bakit po sa YouTube na nag-stream halos Instagram lahat ng streamer? Right nag-stream pa rin ako sa ibang platform, sa TikTok. Majority uh, ng mga subscribers ko sa TikTok. Tapos ito, sa YouTube. Wala, okay, okay dito eh. Okay naman dito. Ayun na, first blood. <laughs> Kung mananalo ko sa Lotto Bus, papasok ba sa initial thought ang gagawa ka ng eSports org or team? Ganda niyan, Nimrod ah. Siguro, siguro. Baka ano. Ito real to ka. Kapag ka, wala kang idea about sa marketing, about sa business side ng eSports, ang hirap kumita dito. Mayroon kumita. So, kapag gagawa siguro ako ng eSports org or team, una ko munang bubuin yung team ko uh, sa marketing, team ko sa production, team ko sa ano. Bago ako mag-start mismo ng magbuo ng sarili kong team. Kasi kailangan mabuo mo na yung brand para mas madali. Paano po kayo kumikita pag off-season? Mga side gigs. May mga gigs kami. May hosting gigs. May mga tournament na kinakast. Uh, may mga part-time work kami. May mga businesses. Sounds daw. Ay, wait lang, wait lang. Ito na. Sorry, boss. Sorry. Most definitely, but AP Brand not trying to let up. A little bit of death through Boots, able to get a bit of damage on a flap TZ there. Basan's also taking a face full of yo-yos. Back of the turtle, Kyle TZ able to take it right out of Kyrie's hands. Well played from AP Brand, keeping himself in the game, and that's what they do. Even when they're behind, they make sure they get the objective where they need it to make sure the goal doesn't get too far away. Sino yeah. po ba yung caster na Tagaylo-Ilo? Si Santi. Si Santi what po. I'm really seeing right now is that everybody's roughly about even, right? I mean, first hurdle, what is that going ngayon, over to ngayon the side of Bonnick? Ngayon nagkukush na sa isang NA team. First hurdle. So, over the side AP Bren. Over the side AP, AP Bren. AP Bren. Okay, so Retri. Retri was able to be landed. AP Bren coming out on top there. And I think this is what was happening in the last game, right? Like... It was just a little bit hard for Kyrie to hit these retries, and I'm not quite sure what could be causing that. I mean, AP just able to zone and properly keep them at bay. And if they can keep that up, it's going to be a little bit of trouble for Onyx. Now, Onyx side, right? They have the sustainability. They have, like you were saying, I mean, I, they have damage. I just don't know if it's going to be enough to penetrate a fair misc. Di si Santi, si Manjin, ilonggo si Manjin eh, Manjin, ilonggo si Manjin. Peace pala si Santi, sorry. Ayan o, diba? Diba na yung hapan si Butch pa eh? Gonna go down, Flap TZ able to pick up the kill. XP diff sila, XP lane diff. Now, on the side of Onik, they gotta respond with 1-1. AP Bren has now taken the gold lead. Is this the Bren effect? Is this the switch that flips? I think this is the, the, the switch. Nila, Kyle TZ, that, 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 that was a tongue twister. <laughs> that was a tongue. I was like, hold up. Like, what did you just say? Yeah, it was Listen, We've been a here a while. Twister. It's zero IQ deaths right now. We're on the zero IQ yeah. desk. We're vibing. We're feeling it. Let's go. <laughs> we're, 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 just, we're just vibing. 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 I like this, right? From the side of Onik. They're, they're already setting up this turtle, but they have to be able to secure this turtle. Let's see a Kyrie. <laughs> Oh, focus mo na, focus mo na tayo guys ha, focus mo na. Trying to get the stone onto Flap Teezy. Kyle Teezy though, making his way around. Boots looking for an angle as well, able to dash through. Kyle Teezy's about to come in, but Fury connects in the flicker. Gets the knock up, Keyboy, able to pull another one, but the damage is shredding him down. Boots, gonna be the next to fall. Super Marco picking up the kill, Kyrie, able to take it though. They're trying to fight back. Albert in the back side, doesn't have the torn apart memories anymore. It's two for one right now. Onik finds the turtle, but loses the extra member. I mean, not ah. Ganda lang na, ganda lang bawi na. We can kind of look at what the engage entailed here. The minerals rage with a flicker. But ganda na pipil ko. Parang Loki gusto ko manalo onik para kumabay ng game. 
And then of course the Pero siyempre pagkatapos ng laro na to, gusto ko pan- mananalo pa rin yung brand. Alam mo yon, parang gusto kong mababa pa yung tour like yung game. The, the <laughs> yung mismo ng grand final para lang masulit. Loki lang naman, Loki na gusto ko lang. Pero siyempre kung gusto nang tapusin ng AP Brand, tapusin na nila. Boy. Just given that pressure and Sana nga mag-onic para lane. sulit po yan. Ewan ko, alokin right, lang. Parang, now, parang trip ko lang manalo ang onic dito. Pero dapat mananalo pa rin pa, ano, sa pinakahuling laban is yung AP Bren. Tignan natin, tignan natin. Tumidipi-tipi na uli si Kibo eh. Kala mo talaga eh. Parang sayang grand finals pag 3-0. Mga nga, agree ako sa iyo, NC Zol. Ewan ko. Sayang puyat eh. Nauna yung medya na eh. And just continuously harass with that yeah, skill, it's, it becomes a problem. But second turtle, now or third turtle, now in. We're six minutes in. Gold still at an immediate tie. Oh, They're looking for Flat Easy here. Is Albert? Albert able Ooh, to get nice a couple speed. of free shots here. Key boy with the Manoans Fury once again oh, gets it on top of the Nether Realm. Connects boy, Kyrie, boy. able to take the turtle. Harkar does lock on to Flap TZ. He's going to be able to unload. A little bit of damage. The Torpar Memories comes off, but still no kills for the side of Onik. AP Bren able to disengage well. Neither team losing a member. They're definitely holding on very well, though. You can already see. I love the read by Super Marco. Uh, the must have just been Flap TZ that was able to give that call out. But it is again going to give up that turn here. From the side of Onik, they need to keep this pressure going. They're able to secure neutral objectives. They've taken a tower already, which I think they just need to continue that focus. And if they can continue that, then AP Brand will be kind of pushed back against the wall. Now, what I think is really coming in on AP Brand's side is that they are kind of lacking a little bit of damage. It could be that we see the fair miss going with a quantum charge which is a little interesting for a mid lane i would say just looking to be engaging and being in the battle so i think they're really relying on super marco which again i mean he's one zero and one he could still get there but i think okay, it's going to be a late game I mean, sila, if Baby Bren gets the time, they will lane. definitely become Sip a problem. A little bit of damage on Flap TZ. A nice knock-up. Mm. The hard guard comes in in the nick of time, but Albert gives him a face full of torn apart memories. Onik finally starting to have the advantage in the map. But they still have to be careful as we always say. Onik. AP Bren could make the strike na na, at any na, na moment. Na, Bren. Yeah, na na, I love bro. that they're going back to the fundamentals, right? Like, they're just securing neutral objectives, taking towers, because I felt like maybe they listen to us oh, like they geez. just weren't secure in towers in the Malay first second game and we're seeing that time three around. items towers pre. don't always mean wins, but it Albert. also allows you Game to assist. punish your team when they overextend during lord Malay fights Picaro, and you know, other Hunter things like so. this but this is so where AP Brin normally flicks the switch so this is where we're gonna have to watch out first lord is here can AP, AP Brin flick the switch Trex Ganda ng reset we'll na ginawa ng Onyx. It's definitely a possibility. Super Marco hasn't taken a death, can still pack a punch. The only problem is AP Oy. Brent doesn't have Lula, that Lula, much. Oh my god, never mind. I was going to say not that much damage, but look at Flap TZ. Shredding down Sons. Sons forcing his Sons. black shoes before Lula, the Lord Lula, fight. Boy. Lord down about 20%. Oh, Here comes an Onyx Fury in the flicker once again. Every time, time after time. Onyx now trying to clean up. The key boy goes down Lula. few, Lula. able to pick up the kill. Albert going to be next, but he Lula, finds Lula, a kill on the Kyle TZ just in time. Kyrie able to take the Lord. But he loses two members. <laughs> Three members make it. AP Bren standing kind of on top. I think it could be a win because they're going to get a tower here. Onik, yes, they get the Lord, but at what cost? 
Yeah, I mean, you can kind of see at what cost the final slash did come out, and it kind of offset AP Bryn there. Torn Apart Memories definitely took them down low. I think they kind of, like, tunnel focused right there, and then they forgot that Kyrie was in the center of board pit and was Thinking still there. Buy, and price and he was on HP, they could have definitely jumped on him, so a little bit of a mistake by AP Bryn. I mean, they were able to take out uh, Albert, but again, they lost the Lord, took a mid tower. They need to kind of focus up and take the left in the uh, right tower as well. Kaya kung Looks like nila pag nila yung 3 million price, full feeling ko kaya nilang abutin yun sa mga next na tournaments. Yun lang yung idea ko. Kasi lumalaki ng MLBB actually, di ba? China, nandiyan na, Russia, nandiyan na. Yung mga regions na malalakas pagdating sa esports, nandito na sa MLBB. Um, it's it's gonna be if they can crack that tier three, it definitely opens things up because right now they're still stuck in the bottleneck of rotating around the map. The moment they hindi get that, it gives them a lot more freedom to be the aggressive team that they want to be. Yeah, like Ogun, you're passing a real problem hero. for AP Brent at this point is that Lilia's Ice Queen one. Like it's just slowing down the team to a crawl, and it's allowing Albert to scale. Now, tao, dinig na, dinig, no? he did take a death there, and you can kind of see I like this. They're focusing now on the turrets. I mean, there's not much else on the map to kind of focus on, kind of put a little bit of pressure. But you got to remember that you're missing towers as well. So overextending could be a little bit of a problem and something that Ana can capitalize on. <laughs> we'll see uh, 65 seconds to the next Lord. It's wild. I mean, at this point, Onik has to be careful still. Flap TZ is becoming a menace. We saw the damage that Flap TZ did, able to get the kill on Alberto earlier, able to keep Sons away. Positioning is going to be key. And they got to catch, they got to catch Flap TZ because he's the, he's the big damage dealer right now. And I think what they're doing is they're using that Manoan Sphere to make sure that Kyrie secures the Lord, which is important, is huge. But if they continue to not catch some of the damage dealers of AP Bren, they're going to continue to try to look at that. Ganun talaga, may mga regions na malakas yung isang game. For example, sa Russia. Alam mo lang ka sa Russia. Dota at saka Counter-Strike. Nakapasok na MLBB. Hopefully, it's a little rough. Sa ISF na first, di ba? Dati wala namang MLBB doon eh. Ngayon, nagkaroon na. ISF dati, more on Dota. If I'm not mistaken, should uh, be a little enhanced. So this is something that AP Bren's going to want to get. Uh, Counter Strike. And is definitely going to gonna get. So you got to watch out for Keyboy. His positioning in that middle for us, rage has been the key factor. Maganda yun. Kapag lumalawang yung esports, lumalawang yung MLBB, mas maraming gigs. Potential gigs para sa amin. The Keyboy is kind of switching it up a little bit, trying to give Sans a little bit of space. He's going to get pulled back in. Kyrie and Kyle TZ, foes of their time, facing off on this Lord again. Angela, Angela. Here's the great thing about the Angela, right? Yeah, because she can hard guard at any moment and be in the fight, and that's one of the tough things about going against Angela is you constantly have to worry about that because Angela doesn't really have to be in the 5v5 until she pops the hard guard. Onik, gonna reset the Lord. Kyle TZ, making an end Kyrie. Able to get the taunt, out comes okay. the nether realm. Sense. That could be huge. Black shoes for for Sans. A little more damage. Oh, there's the Uy, can they catch one? No one. Not yet. Go signal Black Tizi does get the heart guard. They're looking for a little bit more damage. Onyx still taking the slow, but minions are on their inhibitor in the bot lane. Someone's got to go back, and they choose to make it Sans. Kyrie gonna try to make his way in. Kyle Tz there as well. Heart guard gonna be gone. Go no go. nether realm for the side go. of go. AP go. Brent go. 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 Still several go. ults for the side <laughs> of Onyx. I think they need to maybe try to force this now before the clocks Alberto. start ticking and the cooldowns are up. Saglit lang si Ogwin eh. Isang, two, isang corrosive strike it. lang na yun. Ah, Albert, yeah, tapos I, torn apart. What it seems like is that they're just buying time at this point just to be able to push towers in against Onik. And Onik, <laughs> so I mean, the, uh, they are, you know, sense. pushing the lanes in as Lab. well. Left lanes oh. kind of push pretty far for them. But I feel like... Their control, AP Brent's controlling the lanes a little 20K, bit better. 20k, 15k. kind of low. Are they going to be able to, Guys, 15K. to reset it or not? 
Oh, the Kyle TZ takes this Lord. I'm gonna lose my freaking mind. He gets Boy, done. Man. A final slash pushes him to the side. Boy. Can they do it? Key Boy, Boy actually able to take it with no one's fury. But AP Brian not block. quite done yet. Still unloading. Finally, Flap TZ goes down. He's been a nuisance to the team for a while. But now Key Boy goes one for one. Onik finally coming out on top in a Lord fight. Ooh. I mean, right Ooh. now, we're definitely calma. seeing... Calma, baby, calma. Keyboy baby, calma. Baby, calma. Lord, both retries <laughs> weren't available. But hey, I mean, that's a win for the side of Onik, right? They're able to utilize and enhance Lord, keep them at bay. Kind of taking a look at some of the items we do see. Super Marco missing one so far, so not too bad. Brody as well. So both marksmen's about to be online. They... Onik trying not to Onik. go home empty-handed. Definitely not. They want to take us the long haul. They want to keep everybody up late tonight, and I'm okay with it now because Onik <laughs> is up. And I didn't want to see a sweep. I was getting a little tired, but that's okay. But wait a second. In the top Albert side, Albert Patea is too much damage. Oh, in Gogi, trouble, Bushido. you no! gets the Bushido. killing spree. The Kyrie the is the next. The breath effect is online. The switch <laughs> has been flipped. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's not too bad, though. It's not too bad. Two fall on the side of Onik, but super minions are barreling down. Wait, on, ano na, on wind of nature na si Albert. Kailangan uh, niya talaga oh, mag-invest. I mean, it's a good game. It's Pag a good game. Siya, Onik yata, clapping eh. back, but AP Wala Brent seems to be winning in the teamfight area. Ang They AP just Brent. have so, to switch it up a little bit and be able to secure some of those neutral of objectives. Now, if they can't do that, then Onik's diba? going to constantly burst, keep being on top. Hindi naman ganun kasakit yung damage ng Faramis kapag mag ka lang. Kapag marami kayo. That is going to be a big factor when one team's able to do that. We do see a little bit of a setup here. Maybe that could be the flick of the switch. You can already see that they are zoning no, na lanes si so na well, Trax. I will say this. This is the Nagpo first time we've been this far in the game, and Onik hasn't been down about five to 10,000 gold. And <laughs> they were able gaming. Hello, to defend before at a huge gold <laughs> deficit. So I want to say that maybe Pre, them being even or close to AP Bren is na. the advantage. But here's how good AP Bren is. Even in the beginning of this game when they were down in kills, even when it felt like Onik was in control of some of the fights, AP Bren still keeps a solid gold lead. Take us from these items, though. Yeah, taking a look at some yeah, of the items here, na niya, no? really what I'm seeing is Fairmist just now picking up a Divine Glaive, so Albert. a little bit of magic piercing definitely going to be happening on the, the team fights. Again, Brody now has that win of nature versus <laughs> that Albert does as well, sold his boots, so... Um, uh, Super Marco sold his boots, picked up the Wind Talker, so Para that could be... Pare. One of the biggest plays here. I mean, we're 17 minutes in, not super late game, but being able to pick that up right now is huge. Let's see what they're able to do with it here, Tracked. All right, Kyrie. Gonna start off on the Lord on the reset, but TZ, sa, sa per usual, sa Lord just feeling the ground out, rolling around. Gonna get, gonna, get, oh, bueno. gonna get position over the Lord here. Super Marco gonna start to unload Keyboy. Testing the waters to Onik, very grouped up here, Sons, holding the side, and once again, we're going to see Owen win a second, a little bit of damage, Onik's up to TZ there, he's going to be able to chip him back, someone's got to go up and deal with Owen, AP Bren, the Angel back door, non-stop, just harassing, God, that's annoying, you got to feel it for Onik right now, I mean, if we feel like it's annoying, it's definitely annoying, like, ah, someone go deal with Angela again, you know? You as well. You mentioned the design. <laughs> the 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 Here's the thing about the Faramis. Yeah. In the begin oh, wait a second. A lot of damage. Uh -oh. The taunt does lock down. Oops. Flap Teasy gets the heart guard, but it might not do enough. Colt Alter to try to help seal the deal. But still, yeah, Flap Teasy taking a lot of damage. There's the Minoan's oh, Fury. Onik trying to collapse. Oh. Albert able to find Super Marco. Sans picking up the kill. Few now on the run. AP Bren for the first time. Shut back. Shot back <laughs> in three <laughs> series. Shooken down. Onik taking control of the Lord Pit, but look at Kyle Teezy, man. Look at him, he's still gonna try to go for this. Flap Teezy with him, his AP Bren gonna finally back off. They decide to, Onik gonna take the second Lord. Okay, lang. Kaya, kaya naman na dumi ko. Break time, Onik now online. They're putting it to AP. Kulang na sila sa AOE sa setup, eh. 
Five TZ getting some nice chip damage. But Kyle T's in a little bit of trouble, getting way too locked up. Finally taken down from the wow. appraisers. Wrath Son able to pop the black shoes. On it, moving in onto the inhibitor. God. Lord hasn't even showed up yet, but they're gonna break down this base. Onik not trying to go home too early. Got their eyes on the prize here. Lord to make his way down the mid side. Onik ready to fight. Kalma lang, kalma lang tayo guys. Ha. Kalma, yeah, I mean, kalma dogs lang. Kalma, kalma. How much damage they're outputting at this point? I think it's just they're utilizing and baiting quite a bit of the utility by AP Brain. But the siege Gated. is happening. Ay, tapos, uh, tapos. Boots moving in for the final slash. Able to connect onto one. Oakwin goes down. No heart guard for the team. That means. And now Flap T's in a little trouble. Gigi's, Gigi's, Gigi's. Boots finally getting his revenge. Onik oh, getting on. To the base, and that is it. It's not match point. Till Onyx says it is. <laughs> Onyx. Ah! Not one to leave the stadium empty handed. Oh, it takes oh, one oh. on AP Brin. Ah. <laughs> Man, what a battle. Then they and then they and the and the Angela was the one. What are they saying? AOE. The bees have Oof. fallen in AOE. one match. Hindi gan hindi kasi yun yung right. playstyle niya niyo eh. Ni... No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, win actually. Eh. Hindi yun eh. More than set up talaga siya. Time to go back to the drawing board. Kind of taking a look at some of these highlights that went down. The Angela, first blood going on on the other side. On the side of Onik was pretty clutch, but I don't know if it was ultimately the the you know the deciding factor in the game. I think it was mainly how many utilities well, they were able to utilize. Well, nung nawala yung bigsana parang mas dumali para sa Onik. No. Just being able to secure so many neutral objectives, they took so many towers into the early age. And I mean, look at the torn apart memories just tearing apart AP Brain. And this just goes to show that Onik is here. Pag di ng champion Brain kasalanan mo. Oi, grabi ka na mo na tanyo Romano. Flicker Manoan's Fury. Everything you want to do, Brain. Just no escape. Albert as well. We were a little questionable about the uh, about the. Ayre nand mental kal mga lang. Magali. Pack a punch when they needed it. Magali. Able to kind of zone out flat TZ and then boots even at the end. Papa sa rapin din kasi ng AP Brain. Ito mo gusto niyo kaka dumoy. Sayang yung ticket dun sa of the game. Sarasha Brain. And that is huge right there. We see the play happen. We see them finally catch off flat TZ here. He goes down. And this is when everything finally starts to shift. Kind of a, a tug and pull, a tug and pull. But Onik finally kind of takes control here. A little bit of fight in the mid again. This is when AP Bren tugs back a bit. Tama, goes down. And AP Bren takes control. You know why I'm going to be here? I really think it came in clutch that Keyboy was able to utilize the minnows. I hope that it's going to secure the Lord into this late game. Again, the utilization of the nether realm was also great in clutch form. Because they were just stacking up. Albert was just stacking stacks and then the moment the the nether realm let up he just tore tore them apart so it just worked out in their favor okay, guys ah, walang maninisi ah walang maninisi kalma lang ah you okay, see that AP nila yan. Alam nila yan. Alam nila yan. Nila. Alam nila yung lineup. Alam nila yung roster. Alam nila yung consequences. So, kalma lang. Kalma lang. And Boots finally kind of comes online <laughs> to be able to get man, the better <laughs> of Flappy's. Yes, he had Big Brother Lord on his back to help out. But still, Baka kasi inaantok na kayo. Magpahinga na kayo sa mga nanonood pa rin. Makabalita na lang kayo bukas. So siyempre, dahil ayoko makibalita bukas, tatapusin ko to. Well, there it is. Yeah, I mean, in the very beginning, I was Tapusin definitely natin to. a little skeptical about the team comp, but I think ultimately we we approached that end game mark, which allowed the Lilia to just go crazy. So I think paired with that, and then Albert just on the the Brody, it was actually pretty decent. Uh, ano, nakakapuyat tong so, GOF. <laughs> it just it came clutch. Oy, okay, laban mo, RM. Lalaban natin. Lahat tayo ilalaban natin to. The, the, the Tiwala lang kayo, kaya natin to, guys. Okay? Pinabato na ako ng kasama ko sa bahay na pagkakamala na ako, Adik. Ilang gabi na akong puyat sa GOF. Kalma <laughs> lang, kalma ka lang, Biana. <laughs> Yeah, they showed up when they needed to. Wala, ganun talaga eh. Nanalo pa Onik eh. 
people were losing faith. We were losing faith. We were wondering if Onik was going to be able to take something here, able to get their flow back. Mas maano pa nga yung finally actually mas maano pa nga yung ano tapos ng MP. Iba kasi yung time zone. I mean It's 2-1. It's still match point for AP Bren. We still know how strong AP Bren can be, but still to come back after a 2-0 deficit, I mean, it's pretty huge. Taking a look at the kills, it was still a very close game. At any point, it could have gone either way. Yeah, you got to really think about the mental <laughs> when it comes to being so far behind like this. And now, I mean, they have, it's one step to the, the you know, the, the highest pedestal here. Can Ana keep that up? And I mean, Tumibu. if they're able Tumibu. to break Tumibu. the switch of AP, then I think they could definitely do this. They got to hit the switch. Turn turn the the guys, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I, I feel Anyways. like it. We'll see. All right. So Ana takes it. And again, I think in that game, you know, I don't think it had, I don't think it had too much to do with draft that game. I think Honestly, AP Bren had a decent draft. I think one of the major points was Keyboy timing those Minoans Furies perfectly. And, and Onik able to kind of hang in there against the force that AP Bren is. And they, I think they had a very clear job going in there is, okay, we need to just make sure we're able to secure these lords. Like, even if we're a little behind in gold, even if we take a death or two, we have so to so lords. Been the best way to do that is Keyboy to time the Minoans Fury perfectly so that Kyle Tz gets knocked <laughs> lang, up lang, and that Kyle can get a clean retribution Pero off, naman, have ng AP Bren, eh. and first lord you know even some of those turtles Wala, they, eh. they took losses on them they would take two deaths Sonic wasn't really winning off of those but what was definitely not happening is they weren't losing brawl off muna ako. Oh, you know, muna they, they were falling behind muna five, kayo. six, seven k gold by the 15 kayo, habang minute mark chill. so Onik maybe has found an answer to at least keep up with AP Bren throughout the mid throughout the early to mid game Yeah, and I think it really comes down to just solid CC tanks, right? Like, <laughs> just NBA having, mo na ako, I like, eh. of course, they had an Angela, right? So it was, it was a little bit of a problem when it when it just came to that aspect. I, I thought it was going to be a little bit too much support paired with the Fairness. So again, it just came down to great timing, good control. and overall execution. <laughs> Chill muna kayo so, diyan guys. Eh sa mga gustong kumuha muna ng kape, magkape muna kayo. I don't know if they're going to put three ganun. Just, you know, yeah. Kasi matagal-tagal pa to. <laughs> Danyo, kailangan ng energy ni ni Trex at saka ni GDI ko. And they pulled it off. There's something else I want to point out here. No Vexana that game. Yeah. You no did Vexana say that, that earlier. Game. You said that if Vexana I mean, was got banned It was AP Bren who banned it out, but still, like, the pressure that Few brings on, I think, any kind of mage like that, I think is something that we definitely need to look at, something that definitely needs to be made clear. Because the zoning he's able to give him, when you put him on something like the Faramis, it's just not there as much in the early and mid game, and it kind of slows rebound, down the pace. Rebound, rebound. True, true. So, I mean, we've nice seen one, nice one. Bago matulog sa ala, no? Kaso, si Burrito kasi gusto pa manalo ulit. Sorry na, so, sorry na. Hindi just, ko naman ginusto. We'll Sabi ko lang I mean, medyo weird lang na parang, up, like the, the parang, ano, low-king gusto kong manalo yung uh, Onyx. Yun lang yung sabi ko. Huwag nyo akong sisihin. Hindi ako yung naglaro. Do they force the Vexana in the lineup once again? Do, I mean... It seems like the Lilia has just been a game changer for some teams. So maybe targeting the, targeting the Lilia. Um, I mean, there's a quite a few options that they could possibly go with here. Uh, but I think right now, Onik just stays on the same path that they're on. Just keep the, the solid CC up. You definitely need it for when you're, you're taking a board like that. Every time it seems like it's coming down to a 50-50 ratio battle. So, we'll have to go back to see what the Onyx are on a good path. Yeah, they're going to get blue side as well, which I think blue side has been the favorite side for wins. I don't want to see the picture of Onyx are on a little bit differently. On blue side, you can kind of choose to target a bit more if you want and let... and let red side see if they want to do the more of a meta bands things like the joy the matilda you know those things we've been talking about for a while which you know ap bren is normally willing to at least leave one of them open like the guinevere um but still i do feel like you're a bit more in the driver's seat when it comes to the first phase of bands picks a little bit different because you're pretty open to get countered to but um 
But still, I think Onik is in a decent position right now to definitely make this series stretch out. Yeah. Yeah. My overall thought is now, like, what does AP Bryn do, right? You know, they now, they're, they're a little bit on the back foot. What's their overall strategic... Uh, approach to this next match. Do they, do they just rock it out like they did <laughs> in the first ayan, ayan, two? Kind of play oh, ano bang as soon as they possibly can. Can. I felt like Maging they definitely took tayo, a step back because they had two supports this dating time. Ano si Papa Jack? Uh, so I, I feel like that could have been a, uh, a big factor into their overall ano gameplay. Yung sa so maybe, isang babae? maybe not utilizing the famous in the mid. It doesn't seem like it's super effective against Onik. Especially when they have that burst mage in the center. Um... Again, they picked up the carry, but we've seen the carry actually shine sometimes. I just don't think it made it too late into the game for it to really pick up. I mean, it definitely took some time, and it wasn't really able to get into the zone. And again, I think the <laughs> boy was a big answer. Boots was si a big answer ko, that. Si Tire, because si Trex, if, medyo if Super na yan. Marco wanted pa to get inside yan. of that nether realm Dun area, um, you're lower in bracket, constant na yan. danger, right? You're in constant danger from the final slash. You're in constant danger from the no one's fury, um, from an appraisal's wrath. Just a lot of the AOE damage that was coming from the side of, uh, from the side of Onik there kind of made Super Marco forced to stay back a little bit and not really able to scale. Also, something Onik did great in that last series was, you, you noticed it, once they got a lead, they turned that lead, or once they got a kill, they would turn that kill into enemy objectives, right? Into taking those towers, nice into diff. controlling macro, so that even though they were getting split pushed for a bit there by Ogwin, um, it was still kind of evened up in a sense of towers. Yeah, and I felt like that, again, was just... Like the first two games, they were lacking in those the the objective department, right? They just they weren't taking towers. They were end up they were losing turtles and lords. So instead of going for the 50-50, might as well just go for other objectives, right? And this time they were actually winning turtles and securing objectives. Um, and something I've always learned throughout my 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 like mobile legends career is that if there's a kill you need to turn that into something else right like they're down a person let's go get something else right uh, secure secure the enemy jungle secure a tower secure nice one something. Masaki you know, sa Pinas, dito sa Russia, map, like, always take something <laughs> hello sayo fake model dot ph hello sayo birador oh yeah magtanong nga kayo yeah, may question definitely. ba kayo tara I think, um, sabi din natin ang mga questions so I think at this point honestly you asked earlier what does okay? AP brand do I don't think they Kasi really need to change too much. Eh. Baby Calma daw eh. Baby Even that last eh. game was very possible um, that they could have taken it, right? It's very possible that they could have won that last game. Onik was not like in complete control of that game. They were able to get a big play and finish things out. They even rushed it. You know, they didn't even like play it super safe in that last finish. They were like, we got to end now. We got to end now. The feeling is that AP Brand only takes a slower approach. If they get the better of you, they take an inhibitor or two, then they back off and come back for another one. Onik knows it's all we can't match. We can't play with our food. Let's get in there. So definitely... Malakas I think AP Bren can kind of just come into this again. Mara, Mara, play what they want, si you know, play, play what si they feel is best. Sino, uh, sino I, th I definitely think one of the weaknesses in the last one was the Fermis and the Angela. Um, it kind of gave a little bit too much space for Onik. And you don't, and I think one of the things they've done so well is smothering Onik. And that's where Onik kind of falters. Because Onik's mana? not used to teams Nick smothering them, right? Onik's, I don't think Onik is really used Ako? to teams Hindi, just like yeah, bullying sila. them in the laning phase and Kaya things like that. And I think that's where AP Brent kind of has their number. It's like, okay, we have the wala skill, we have the micro mechanics to kind of go there with you. And when they do that, Onik kind of falls apart sometimes. Yeah, definitely, definitely. And Landaya eh. I still I, I, I enjoy man libre. the the streets that may dalang kung ano that, like, si Mara. You're stating, you know, but I'm, I'm still like, do they run si with the same comp? Uh, I know that they they, they were kind of just di, lacking di a bit of damage, man, and I kind of felt like that was going to be uh, the case, especially lang, since mga I mean. Lang. I know that Basha definitely does counter the threat a little bit just because of that that jungle speed. But I think the early death lang namin actually that was uh that he took was like one of those downfalls. It already slowed okay, down at that point. Pero hindi siya 
to the point na mamimigay ka ng pera sa kasal. Angela just didn't help like any of the other Romes did that <laughs> they played, right? Like, like the Angela just can't jump in there, can't give vision, or she'll pay for it, which I think in the very beginning, she was the first the first one to die, which uh, again, is just a little bit of a tough choice. No, so I, I think it was ultimately na, they, they, were, they were trying to bring the <laughs> sorry, AP mina, style you know, into something ko kasi, sorry. that is a little no, laxative ano and feeling not ko as easy to pull that style off. You know? Sorry, I think, I, think I think it's definitely a fair <laughs> statement overall. Um, I want to take a look at see if they're up just yet. <laughs> at some of the last at some of the last picks and bands real fast since we have some time to kill it seems um first bands for the side of ap bren there they banned out the vex they banned out the joy they banned out the navaria this time onik is gonna be blue side again um i, I still calma believe calma that guys. onik should Baby maybe calma. stick to what they did ban out the vexana um maybe even if they don't want to first pick it maybe even ban out the r lot because they are, I mean, the, in the hands of AP Bren, that Arlot is just vicious. Whether it's Ogwin, whether it's whoever, does look like finally we're going to be jumping into the draft. Still match point for AP Bren. Onik trying to get the rerun here, trying to tie things up and bring it all down to one game. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Uh, I mean, Onik said we're not going to be able to first pick the there minnow. So let's get rid of the minnow. Let's get rid of the Vexanas. They're, they're targeting key heroes that were definitely disrupting their flow. And I think they're ready, right? Like, this is match point still. Yeah, this is the uh, So, Onik going to have to really strategize here when it comes to this. And, uh, you know, like you said, it's not a best out of seven, but they're, they're kind of, now that they have this extra game, like, they're, they've been able to learn. They've been able to see the little bit of a weakness that AP Bryn had. Uh, be it the draft, be it the, the overall control in the game, but I think this is the time that they're able to like mount up a game plan. Now they're going the fair miss. Now there's two options here. Do they leave open the Matilda or do they leave open the Guinevere? I mean, definitely, I, I think it's, ooh, they leave both open. Yeah, they're going to leave the Vixana. It's hard to force it so they eh. can get one. I feel like that's the best thing in the lineup. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's, that, that's normally the strat here. They might leave the Gwynny open. Just That's what we saw in what game one. They left the Guinevere open. open the Bandit yeah. was like literally almost the same exact position. So they could, they they know they, they can play well against the Guinevere. Um, they might just be the Matilda here if they see it as that much more of a threat. They go for, no, they leave both open. So... Does Onik pry the Gwynny or the Matilda? I think they got to take the Matilda. I was thinking so too. Matilda. But I mean, what we did just see, I mean, they're going for it. Yeah. I was like, but it, it seems like they need solid CCs to interrupt Kyle TZ. So picking up that Matilda, does that force them out of that comfort zone that they just had in the last match? Like, you're going to have speed, but are you going to have CC? Um, I mean, win. it's definitely possible. I, I'm, I'm wondering. Yeah, nah. go, uh, my thing is now win. that now that they have this Matilda, they can go for like Onik can kind of go for something a bit lower pace if they go, want. Like, like they could go, for, yeah, go like for the Barats now. Um, we didn't mm -hmm. see them pick it before. We also haven't seen Kyrie in general play it a whole lot. Um, now with the Nana picked, they do need to think about a mid lane here. There's no Novaria. There's no Vexana. Um, they need something here. They could go for the Lily again, lock it in now. Yeah, it could be solid okay, there. Okay, okay, that's Lilia. Ooh. Nana, Lilia. Barrax. Good. 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 First We've been here a little bit. Here. <laughs> classic to, ah. Classic. Now for the classic Barrax Matilda. Their final pick here. Do they, I mean, they could lock in the Arlot. I mean, that, that would be a good team control. I mean, the Minnow's already banned. Uh, so, mga naglalaro I mean, they can go Tang as well. Like the NBA Infinite. I, take, I, I, don't I think know. the Arlot's oh. honestly really solid. Just I mean, because it's flexible. We know that both Flap and mm. Owen can play it if they want to. Legend. Um, it leaves them very open. And they, yeah. they both of them, Flap TC and Owen, both play it amazingly. They but they go CC. for the CC. CC's a monster. It's I, I mean, CC's like a, a point away from just being on the band board every single, you know, in the draft, <laughs> honestly. Yeah, I, but I feel like is, is she going to be able to keep up with the speed? that the Matilda offers, right? Like, I feel like she has to have that presence to Wait, harass. Like, and if the Matilda's there, 
I feel like that's where the, the, the conflict happens. Si Manjin mayaman doon kayo mangingi. Oh, doon kayo mangingi. Punta kayo sa stream niya. Sabihin nyo. I mean, we know who he is. Ano? So, Namimigay ng skin actually yun si Manjin. Punta kayo sa stream niya. Tapos sabihin nyo. Sabi ni Burrito. Namimigay daw po kayo ng skin. Puntahan nyo. Puntahan nyo. Guys, lahat ng nandito ngayon. Punta kayo sa stream ni Manjin. Tapos sabihin nyo na pinapunta po kami dito ni Burrito. Sabi daw niya po ay namimigay po kayo ng skin. Digit, may parapula tayo mamaya. Punta kayo doon. Kahit malista lang kayo. Okay na yun. Sandali na grawan kayo. Shout out if may taba, taga Cavite na nanonood. O shout out pala sa mga taga Cavite. Marami tayo mga friends na taga Cavite. Si Odin ngayon nasa Cavite ha. Ano naman sa loobong nyo si Odin sa Cavite? Katie Buck? Kaya may punto yun eh. Medyo humihirap to ah. Albert has a lot of leeway room here. Yeah. I mean, they need to find some type of way to deal with the Lilia. I feel like the Lilia was definitely... A pain in the last game for AP. Brody sila. Mag-brody kaya sila. Banning out quite a few marksmen. I mean, Natan and Nathan stole on the board. So maybe AP, maybe think about picking that up. But Onik could pick that up as well. Kailangan ng tutunaw kay Albert. Ay, kay ano? Kay Barats. Ruby, Rome, Jungle, Glenn. Ano naisip niya na tutunaw sa Barats? EXPCC. Nana, they still need a they still need a marksman here. It will get last pick. I think it's a solid kind of way to see what Albert's gonna lock in. Hair still a possibility. 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 Hair still Um, I don't know if it works against transformations against uh, I know it works uh, against the like C in lockdown, yeah. but I don't know if it works against the transformation of the Molina. Uh -huh. I want to know this last pick. What marksman? No, okay, yeah. Is it the Bro, Nathan? Is it the, oh, the, the, the Beatrix? Okay, okay. I mean, you don't, all Makes you got to do is really click the, the attack button the with the SMGs sense. and you're able to hit the Wan Wan, so yeah. I can see it. I could see it. Also, I mean, snipe it. You can also play range against the one one in the early in the early laning phase with the sniper. You can build for whether you want to do shred damage against the barats, whether you want to uh -huh. do burst damage. You have plenty of options and plenty of outs. So I think it's definitely a flexible, solid pick for the side of Avery. Definitely Bay not Adita. marksman we see all the time, but I definitely yeah. don't think she's just like game board. Okay, atinto, atinto, guys. Ah, yeah. yeah, AP Brins pulled it out. I think once or twice before, so. They're they're comfortable with it. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Shout out to all the people who watched that one. Shout out to all of you. I hope that you enjoy it. I'm wondering if I'm going to be able to champion the AP brand. Because it just was never banned. Kaya I think it'll just come down to seeing how well it can be utilized in team fights earlier in the comps. Okay, let's go. One one scale and go crazy. So let's see. Oh. Well, I think Albert's been the only one to pick up the Wan Wan so far. I don't think any other team has ran it yet. I think he's been like the trademark pick for it, unless it happened in group stages. But here we are, jumping into the land of Dawn. Onik trying to tie things up. AP Bren trying to get out of here early. It's match point once again at the Games of Future Grand Finals. This is AP Bren versus Onik. Yeah, we can already see that AP Bren's kind of rotating early with the Ruby, which is a little wild. I guess maybe trying to help clear the mid lane a little bit faster against uh, Lilia, which is a little understandable. But uh, the passive. I know. They went for it. Even the crowd got a little loud there. I heard it. <laughs> you gotta love when the crowd interacts with like what's going on. Uh, right now, you can actually see that the pressure on the side of Marco. They really want to stop. They really want to stop. They really want to stop. They put pressure onto Super Marco. And I think the Matilda is going to be a play here. The Matilda Bratz combo is just an overall good combo. It allows. 
uh, the jungle to be able to rotate and move fast. And you can already see that Kyrie's putting on the pressure on the enemy jungle. And I mean, Gwen also has the ability to roam and, and put pressure and to be able Or to secure si jungles. But si let's see if paired with the Matilda, they're able to do it quicker on Bibigin the side of the XP. Win conditions. What do you think here, Trex? Though. I mean, win conditions overall. I think both teams scale. Both teams have a pretty uh, a decent late game. You have Albert on the one-on-one. One. I think something that is going to be crucial for the side of Al uh, for the side of Onyx is making sure that Albert has decent space and a decent game. And with the Matilda and with the Barats, they should be able to cre create ample opportunity for Albert to get something off. I like it. Sans taking a little bit of damage here. Oh, and in the mid side. Boy. The major thing that everyone's going to watch out for is Ogwen with that I'm offended. This guy knows how to make a step when he needs to. He knows how to make a play when he needs to. Ito yung mga gantong gusto ko kay Ogwen eh. Yung mga setup heroes na eh. So it's definitely a solid answer. Juan Juan has the built-in purify. Wala rin mamamamaan dito si Flappy. I think one of their win is going to be kind of layering a lot of their attacks. Everyone not blowing their load at once, kind of taking their time with these team fights. Makakatakas, makakatakas. Yeah. I feel like also Kyrie is going to have to manage those stacks really well. And if AP Brandon, you know, disrupts that, it could be a little bit of a problem, but maybe a little bit of an engage. Your boy able to get the knockup on Ogwen Sans. Trying to get out, but not able to. Flap Tizi getting the final hit. First blood for the side of AP Bren. Okay, so Kyrie decides that's it. We're calling off. Back to your stations. Yeah, but Ogwen doesn't want to let up. Flap Tizi, oh, they're all no, over him. We're gonna force him to use the retry here. He's gonna be okay, but at least safe they force that out. AP Bren with the adding health. He's not using the retry. They're gonna try to go for a purple ball. Walang retry si Kyrie, ah. I mean, they can, right? I mean, they have the retry. This would be clutch for him. Kyrie gets the Daytona's welcome, though. And the stun. Kyle Tizi takes a lot of damage. Able to get away. Grand Theft Purple. Ogwen. Just dashing through Kyrie, gonna be okay, oh, but mad. still, that is huge. Yeah, he's walking up by himself. He's, he's like, nah, forget he's this, man. <laughs> you ain't gonna steal my whip. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't no great that that purple Eddie. without any consequences. No, nah, that was that, that's 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 a good go by the side of AP. They keep up this pressure. I think just kind of reverting back to what they did in game one and two. And they're just applying heavy, heavy pressure. Right now, we're not seeing too many rotations. I mean, it's four minutes in with only one kill. We can kind of take a look at some of the items. We see Corrosive Scythe being picked up by Albert, which is clutch. Right now, I think... Uy, bumabalik, oh. Flap TZ. A little bit of damage on the flap, but flap still. I mean, that's just the CC right there, man. It's like, even when you think you got the better, out of nowhere, she's throwing more yo-yos in your face. <laughs> I don't understand how you heal with a yo-yo, but it's there. Juan Juan, though, struggling a little <laughs> bit down here against uh, Super Marco. Oh. Two Ooh, major happening still. It's 1-0. and oh, Gold at a small deficit mm -hmm. for AP Bren. But this is definitely a good spot for yeah, them. If Super Marco can keep dominating this top lane, Super Marco. and yeah, Albert having to slow lane, play this, like I said, it's going to be a problem. Lane. They need Albert to scale. They need Albert to be able to get some free waves here. Walang way si Albert to para mabilis to clear ng minions. Oh, a lot of damage on the keyboard. The keyboard key 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 might just be able to get away from this. Use the circling eagle, but no. Taken down and a kill goes into the pocket of Super Marco. I wonder if Super Marco picked up the Blade of Despair. Because right, he's doing a lot of damage at this point, right? And now the turtle is probably going to be uncontested because you can already see the side of the map. Bravest fighter on the flat, but I think it's going to be too much of a problem. Onik, I like this. They're responding. They know they can't get the turtle, and this is what I was saying before. Can they take something here? Oh, AP Bren takes something themselves, finds Sans. <laughs> Sons two shot, deaths yeah. now, not at the place we want to Up see a Lilia. Game, AP Bren feeling confident oh in themselves. Gosh. The switch might have been flipped here. I'm wondering how much more aggressive they're gonna get. Top lane. Yeah, I mean you can already see they're gonna uh no, you know, Oreo this this tower right here. Oh no, they backed off. They seen the the numbers difference was there. Again, I think the side of Onik, they just got to keep this up. Like you were saying, Albert needs to kind of get fed, keep the, the games coming. And uh, Sans, I mean, I'm going to have to stop dying here. They're, they're definitely taking advantage of it. But the Matilda not know, coming into too Albert, big of a play yet. Yeah, definitely being monsters. Nah, nah, Kyrie's still trying to zone. Albert. 
Uh, he's kind of been he's right. kind of been on his lonesome lately, and that's because Kyrie. I mean, that's because Keyboy has been forced to kind of babysit other areas, move around the map, stay close to Albert. Luckily, Albert hasn't taken a death yet. That's very important. Problem is, na naman, no? Few though on this na naman, no? is definitely going to end yeah. up being a problem as well. It's going to be hard for Kyrie. He's going to have to watch out for those Molinas because that could be the game changer in a big retribution battle. True, true, and. I mean, just the pressure. We're, this is like literally just reliving game one. Like they are just applying so much pressure on Onik, and they have to find some type of relief here. But again, I feel like at some point they're yeah, keeping. Uh, I mean, they're keeping this left tower, which is it's good, right? Albert just has to get a key play on this one one, and it can make differences. And they're just a little too late there. Onik yeah, looks for the play nonstop. But AP Bren is constantly answering faster. They know them. They know when they're coming. They feel it out. And like you said, they're just eating up at Onik right now. Kyrie unable to get his last orange buff. They're losing towers in the bot. Here comes another turtle. Last turtle of the game. Keyboy going to try to make the roundabout. Not able to get a knock on to anybody. The bombs come down and Kyle T's able to take Kyrie. Taking huge damage. Unable to even finish the Detona's welcome. The rest of his team not there to help out. He went from a big dino to a tiny dino right there. It was... Big dino to a dead dino. Yeah. AP Brin just controlling the field turned him into a fossil. Calma, calma na. Calma, guys. On it. Going to have to figure out a way to bite back. And I think, I mean, th they're controlling it here. I just think at some point Hindi we need to see Albert into an engage, but they don't want to lose him. Oh, oh, they were gonna go, I thought he was going oh, yeah, for, no. the, for the quick no scope right there. Almost hit Super Mario. Flap easy because he can't get the no scope. Crossbow tank of Albert. He's trying to land down. So I could get the no scope. Losing out on the mid side as well. AP Bren looking to close the distance here. Can they clear this wave? Bule, boots, pass up. Oh, Gwen, oh, I'm offended, but a lot of damage. Boy, on to few force back Sons looking for the chase. Does okay. have, doesn't Not have up. the black shoes, so can't overcommit. But Boots able to get the land down onto Kyle Teasy. But out comes the mirror's pass. Kyle Teasy is forced to back off. Lang. A nice crossbow of tank, but still no finishes for Onik. AT Brent still tank. controlling with the 5k goal lead. If I was on the side of Onik right now, I would just... They, they gotta play a tactical at this point, right? Like... Albert's still doing really good. Keyboy hasn't died, but... Oh, I think he needs to be in a little bit more of a key location to be able to save his team sometimes. Mainly, Sans at this point kind of die and taking a look at some of the items. We do see the, the Demon Hunter sword being picked up by Albert. So could be coming online, but the biggest difference is that Super Mario has the Malefic Reward secured and the Blade of Despair. So the damage is a lot. Oh, Boots gets pulled boots. back though, with the I'm offended, there's no way to get the stun, Boy, trying to shoot. respond. Able to come back, using the guiding wind, Sans able to pop the black shoes. AP Bren, oh, snap. pulls everything they can, oh, but Onik, do they want to try to push this over? Nobody Wala, falls si in such a pwede, clash, pwede and hero teams dito, like this could pull something Ay, like that bread. off. Flap Teasy still holding down the front line. Kyrie, here comes the conceal play, watch for Ogwen, watch for Flap. Kyrie taking a lot of damage here. Ogwen gonna get locked up, misses the I'm offended. Boots misses the stun. Super Marco looking for an okay, angle. Kyrie able to take the first lord of the game okay, there. They okay, lose Sans in Boots though. Maka basag pa nga sa gitna eh. Last game they're able to control the objective. Basag 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 Bren may be able to crack, crack through this tower. Basag basag gitna. Yeah, I mean this is basag good yun, pressure bird. by AP Bren, but Onik able to okay, secure lang. it. Nice I feel like nice. it's good. Look at Albert. Possibly going to be able to make a play. Eh. Maybe on the flap. Do they attempt it? They have keyboard with the ah, 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 off. They got the Lord. They stall out a little bit more, but how long can they continue to play the stall game for <laughs> AP Bren with a dominating lead right now? Yeah, and we can already see Super Marco is just coming online. The damage is devastating. When the SMGs collide into any of the team fights, it's just ah, it's too much. Really, right now, if I'm on the side of Onik, they're, they're doing what I would do, right? Just keep, uh, lang lang guys, uh, lang. keep him going. He's 1-0-0. Zero zero. Really haven't seen any crossbow tanks coming out just yet, but when they do... 
that's probably going to devastate AP Bryn. So I feel like that's the biggest thing we have to watch out for. I, we don't see a win of nature being picked up uh, by Super Marco, but we Continue. do see by Albert. So again, this is what I was that? saying. This could Fairly. be a turning grace. Ooh. Still play from Ogre, Ooh. not able to find too much. Kyle TZ dashes under the tower. Onyx still just trying to defend here. Albert playing the offlane, doing it well. Just warming up, still hasn't taken the death. So yes, you're right, that's huge. But AP Bren, man, this is exactly where they want to be. And at this point, they feel comfortable. They're just going to kind of freeze up the lanes a little bit. At this point, they feel comfortable. They're just going to kind of freeze up the lanes a little bit. Slow play things. Hold their gold lead and wait for Onyx to step out a little bit too much. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, he oh, missed both he... shots. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like if you oh. had the SMG right there, Sans would have been panicking, yeah, but... I mean, Sans panicked anyways. He's like, black shoes, black shoes! <laughs> <laughs> was not messing around. I mean, I think it was smart Sniper if he stayed shots. there. It could have been bad, but either way, like, yeah. you see the snipe come out, you're like, oh, I gotta go. No, no. no. you don't know who else is in the bush. Kyrie. Oh, hindi niya Kyrie. A little bit of a skirmish oh, here at the purple Kyle. buff. Kyle Pop TZ. Buti na lang may ano. Well. Super Marco gonna back off. Guy few win. stays Ooh. behind. Taking a lot of Ooh. damage. Few in trouble. Forced to use a flicker there. Takes a little bit of burn, but the passive does not proc. AP Bren still in control. Yeah, I mean, I think they're they're in a little bit of control, right? I mean, right now Onik able to, you know, control a little bit of the right lane and the turtle area. I feel like this is gonna be a key play. Do they go opt for a concealed play? Kind of how do they approach this here? Utilities available for both sides. Only thing is that uh, Nana does not have that flicker, so could be huge. You can kind of see Few staying into the back line, trying to keep them at bay. Onik, what's your play? I don't know. I mean, they, they do have control over the pit, but last time I felt like they had a little bit of control over the pit as well. They don't want to step too far out. They, they can't really take full control mm. because if Boots gets to the other side of the river, he just gets torn apart. If Keyboy steps to the other side of the river, he just gets torn apart. So they kind of have to play this half and Ooh. half game. Oy. Sans You're in trouble long. goes down to make a kill into You're the hands long. of Super Marco. Onik aborts oh, mission. They're going to back <laughs> off. They're going to give this lord over. It's 25 seconds till Sans is back up, and AP Bren isn't going to wait that long. Long. I mean, it looks like they, they pulled back a little bit to maybe attack again. Lord Low. Oh, the Molina Blitz oh, does land on to Kyrie. Good thing lang walang tao doon na mali pa ng retro si Kyrie. Kasi Kyle Tz. As well for it, Onik unable to make a move. Keyboy utilized the Purify to, to stay out of the I'm offended. It could have been really bad for Onik at that engage. Again, taking a look at some of the items, we still don't no, see the no, no, being picked up by Super Marco, but the damage is there. Lang, there lang. it is. Wind of Nature secured. This could be a tough go here, as we have not seen Albert use one crossbow of Tang. He used one, but it didn't do anything. Did he? Oh, God. He's one. Oh, that's a vengeance. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. I'm offended on Kyrie. He's going to get knocked up by the violent Requiem, and he's taken low. Kyrie's still on the map. Boy, though. Pa, boy, pa. just survive. No members from either team have dropped okay. yet, but the inhibitor has fallen. Albert trying to get the Kyle. swift plays, move Bo. around. Oh, Does get the crossbow tang mark, but he's not able to do it. Forced to bounce back to the team. Kyrie, Kyrie. going to get his tone as welcome. Bash him against the wall. Like Brock takes a little bit of damage, but the I'm offended. Locks on to Kyrie. Kyrie taking too Ooh. much. Can he survive this? A little bit of play. Kyle TZ dashes back onto the team. Brand got what they were looking for, but still nobody drops. And it's just insane to think about two teams like this can have a battle that long <laughs> and nobody seconds. dies. That was crazy. Lords barreling down. Sustainability from both teams. And that just goes to show like the micro play coming from both sides are just so good. And to be honest, I was su suspecting Super uh, Super Marco to actually be dealing some like critical damage, but Onyx just able to eat it. Oh. He's gonna lose another purple. He sees no buffs this Man. game. Kyle T is always there, the man of Kyrie's the nightmares right now. <laughs> just retry after retry after retry. <laughs>
<laughs> Kyrie even has to, he even tried using the retreat, but he's still unable to get it. Kyle Teasy and the team showing pure dominance. Yeah, I mean, there right now, AP Brins. Yeah, this is what I was saying, right? Like in the early stage, if, Wait, if Kyrie's not able to keep up these stacks, Marco, Marco. it's going to uh -oh. be. Uh -oh. Oh, oh, no! <laughs> Marco! Oh. Albert, why? Oh, no. He's not good. Shotgun loaded, bow, bow, boom. Albert's gone, and now AP Bren smells the blood. Here comes the Bren effect. Flap Teasy gonna flap on in. Oh, Gwen, looking for something the... as well. Kyrie just trying to defend Ooh. with the rest of the team, but boom! Oh Super Marco takes out another. The target is locked, and they're taken down. Sans and Albert are off the map. The two major damage dealers is AP Bren gonna try to finish this out here. No, One no, big mistake no, 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 no. to finish no, no. things off. Kyrie taking way too much damage. Keyboy looking for the knockup. Boots into the backside oh. with the bravest fighter. They're just trying to defend, but the minions keep on coming. Ladies and gentlemen, AP Bren, undefeated, undisputed from world champions to the games of the future. They take it all. <laughs> And now they are the Fidgetal Games champions. Congrats, congratulations. See how happy they Ooh, are. They're standing no. in chairs. <laughs> Look at, I really wish I could hear the crowd. It's probably going wild at this point. Man. I love it. I love it. Grab the AP Bren, man. Most about seeing AP Bren is their reactions yeah, every yeah. single <laughs> These guys are the best. Alam mo na may tutumbay. Right She not gonna the best. Beses, pre, pag nabuo, yun, dinaya, eh. Anything they touch, they are Gago. dominating in. We saw a full best of seven this time, <laughs> last time, but this time in the rematch, AP Bren makes quick work of on it. Congrats, 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 I mean, very well done. Fans Two around hits. the world, I'm sure it paid off if you've been watching. They did it. I mean, the fans are kind of looking quiet from our side, from what I've seen. But hey, looks like it was a good game. I love, I love the sportsmanship right here, right? <laughs> look, look at this. Look, they're just that. That is like Flatizzi, man. happiness Flatizzi. on a whole again, other level. Man. Happiness on a whole other level. And it looks like we're gonna be. Are they gonna be raising the trophy? I think we're gonna have a trophy raise here. Both teams stepping up to the podium. I'm excited to see it. Yeah. I wonder who's gonna who's gonna get to raise it. Are they all gonna do it at once? Let's see. I never really got a good look at the trophy, but I can only I've seen it in like the videos. And they, dude, they're not even worried about the trophy. Like the excitement on these guys are just overpowering all of their physical. <laughs> they're just, I mean, well, they're just too happy. Yeah. I understand it though. And that's the thing, right? it's, it's, it's not just about it's not just about the money. It's not just about the trophy. It's it's about the win. And and right now these guys are feeling themselves, man. It's two no, huge championships back to back. AP, oh. AP Bren has done <laughs> yeah, it over Trevor. and over again. No, and they feel great about it. Look at them. I mean, that's another notch in the belt there. Another huge win for AP Bren and for the Philippines themselves these guys are the best in the world and it's just undoubted AP Bren able to set off the year of 2024 the biggest international tournaments that we've seen by storm and just man you could just thanks I, I love I'm like cheesing over here just because like you could just see how excited they are and it's just it's lovely to see that a team that's worked so hard and has this type of dedication <laughs> yeah, it just goes guy. crazy. I'm wondering if there's going to be an interview. Um, I'm wondering if we're going to get to hear anything from them. I would love to personally. It does look like there's going to be a stage. I, I want to say that you can watch the actual interview. It's probably going to happen on the, uh, on the Russian channel, most likely. Um, so if you guys want to catch that, feel free to jump on over. I think it's going to be official. I'm sure the, the full interview will be there. We're He's not gun free. Right now, so we're kind of missing out on some of this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm wondering what He's that not si GDI was <laughs> that was handed off. Is that like another trophy? Maybe an MVP that we just couldn't hear? 
I'm guessing it went to. C'est flap, c'est flap. C'est name, baby. Super Marco? That's the only thing I could possibly play. Amazing. I think that's going to be it for us, though. It was an amazing experience. And we see a huge win from AP Brand. I can only talk about it so much, but they have definitely just stormed the stadium. Let's take a quick look at these highlights. Let's take a look at the last highlights of the night. Oh, man, we just got to give it up to Super Marco. Uh, overall, the whole team, like you said, Trex, like, they, they were... They just controlled it just like the very first and second game. You can see that even though they lost the ball, they still took two down on the side of Onik. And that was one of the turning points. And then also Super Marco right here being able to take down Sons. Just it pushed them back. Like you said, they had to hit the ball button. They were like, oh god, we're not going to be able to contest this. They did attempt, but it wasn't enough. 15 minute mark. La la, shout out to Jalpo, shout out to Brad, you know, the hello, John Ray. Hello, Birad, don't know, Mindanao, you're in Carta. At every corner, it looked like they were low. La la. And the fight just kept going. They kept poking and peeling and trying to take anything on it. And the side wait lang, of the Brad. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, no, they replay the man randomly, man. Wait, lang. Calma lang. Man, I, I love to see it. Just the. I'm, Onik did, they put up Wait such lang. a great Halapin fight in okay. okay the Halapin last game, AP Brin coming in hot, coming Ito. Natin, ah. Bren smells the blood, here comes the Bren effect. Flap Teasy gonna flap on in. Ogwin looking for something as well. Kyrie just trying to defend with the rest of the team, but boom! Oh Super Marco takes out another to Not what they were looking for, natin, but ah. still nobody drops. Barely micro. Ay, hindi pa ito. Wait lang, hanapin natin. Nasa baba na yung Lord eh, saglit ha. Hanapin natin. Hindi ako papayag na hindi natin makita yun. Umiha pa ata eh. Ayan na. Game. Get it. Ito na, ito na. Panoorin natin, panoorin natin. Balikan natin, hindi pwede. I mean, right now, AP Brins. Balikan natin. Yeah, this is what I was saying, right? Like, in the early stage, if Kyrie's not able to keep up these stacks, it's gonna be... Boom, boom. Oh, no! Marco! Albert, why? Oh, no! Hindi nakahampas, Gagi! Marco's waiting for him and the shotgun loaded. Bow, bow, boom! Albert's gone, and now AP Bren smells the blood. Here comes the Bren effect. Flap Teasy gonna flap on in. Looking for something as well. Kyrie just trying to defend with the rest of the team, but boom! Oh Super Marco takes out another. The target is locked, and they're taken down. Sans and Albert <laughs> are off the map. The two major damage dealers is AP Bren gonna try to finish this out here. Grabe, grabe. One big mistake so to finish ganda. things off. Kyrie taking way too much damage. Dalawa lang actually. Dalawa lang. The bravest fighter. They're just trying to defend, but the minions keep on coming. Ladies and gentlemen, AP. Bren undefeated, undisputed from world champions. Uh, to the big congratulations, the congratulations. Uh, Lala Alamanun, Gagi. Fireflux and RQ will also walk away with a decent prize pool. It's been a wonderful event overall. Six and last looks. Grabe, I mean, ganda nun, ganda nun laban na yun. Last time, Super Marco unable to get any kills and Sans was leading, but this anyway, time, Super Marco still kills with that. Anyway, congratulations pa rin sa lahat ng mga nag-participate sa Games of the Future. It just goes to show how important these two players are to the team. Sa lahat ng mga sumama dito sa ating broadcast. But with that, I think we're all out of stats to talk about. We're all out of games to talk about. It's been an amazing week. We've seen some amazing games and games of the future. And it's a blessing to be a part of this. A huge grand finals to be able to cast for us. It's a blessing to be able to cast with you, G. Shout out, I mean, with you, G. Shout out to all the fans around the world from Philippines to America. Thank you so much, Bala. Thank you so much. It's definitely been amazing to be a part of this.
I know. It was a good send off uh, track, I, I appreciate it. I love being a part of this. And a, a big shout out to the Fidgetal Games and the Games of the Future. It was amazing <laughs> to get to see <laughs> so <laughs> many teams. Oh, maraming salamat pala sa lahat ng mga nanood dito sa live stream na to. Of course, uh, sa lahat ng mga... We'll see you guys later. Nagdito sa lahat ng mga tumutok dito sa YouTube, sa lahat ng sumuporto sa Pilipinas, siyempre, at sa, ano, sa lahat ng inaantok na. Tara, magpahinga na tayo. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, bukas na lang ulit. mag na tayo, mag-stream na tayo. Balik na ulit tayo sa regular streaming bukas. Sa, yan lang. Bye, ingat kayo. Bye-bye. Mm, okay. Love you. Ingat, ingat guys. Ingat guys. Sana nag-enjoy kayo. Congratulations pala ulit sa AP Bren. Congratulations sa Pilipinas. Tayo na naman ang pinakamalakas. By the way, bago pala tapusin itong live stream na ito, no, manood kayo at su- supportahan at subaybayan nyo ang uh, MPL Philippines Season 13. Mag-start na po siya sa March 15. Pero bago yun ay MDL Philippines Season 3 naman sa 12, okay, March 12. So yun lang, maraming salamat at tabangan nyo. Napakaraming mga teams na abangan para sa MPLPH. Napakaraming bagong roster na abangan. Tapos abangan yung commercial namin nila, Butters, ha? <laughs> yun lang, binigyan ko lang ng splok. Sige na, bye-bye, bye-bye. <laughs>